Okay, welcome back. Um, we are going to be continuing with the Sicilian campaign here. We got, it's a big sports day, so we got all sorts of that still going on. Um, so we got we got the Tour de France on the on the TV here, and then um, we've got the horses on the laptop, and then we've got the Crusader Kings on the computer monitor. So lots going on. Also, we're eating sushi. There's just a lot going on. Drinking some beer. Tons going on. So much going on. Um, okay. So, where we left off last time, we just held our feast. So, we died. Um, or, you know, now our father died, King Robert the Fox. Oh, the Fox. Um, so we're still around now. We're we're a king guy now. That's cool. Very excited uh, to be king guy, and we got some good traits. We're brave, which is nice. Temperate, impatient. And in a three-star intricate web weaver, so really good at the intrigue. So we picked a path that that kind of led down the intrigue world. And um, And then we've got uh, we've got most people like us here. That's cool too. We held that feast, which helped. This guy really doesn't like us, but that's okay for now. This mayor still doesn't like us. Fine, we'll figure it out. Safely. We could use the gold, but I'm not sure I want him to go negative on us. Keep it rolling here.
Nice. We successfully swayed our bishop, so he likes us now. So now we can switch to swaying the Pope. Sway the Pope. Not a great chance of succeeding, but we'll give it a shot. We have pretty good intrigue going on because we got our wife contributing to intrigue, and she's really good. Decent. She's eight. Oh, she's not that great, but... Hmm. I wonder if actually... Hmm. Because she's considered poor. Is that actually being destructive to intrigue? I wonder if we should put her on something else. Um... Like Marshall. Let's have her try that. Bishop endorses us now, so that's nice, too. Oh, and our wife is pregnant. Huge. <laughs> Good time to tune in. Hey, there we go. We have a son now. And that is our new heir. Okay. Got, yeah, name our son Guy. Um, we name our son after our father. That's kind of cool. Her father, no. Good Catholic man. Sicilian name. Like. Massimino. Curado. Simuni. Felici. Uh, hermano. Giovanni. Not digging these Basilian or these uh, Sicilian names. Oh, V2, that's kind of cool. Um, good Catholic name: Simon, Nicholas, Abraham. Uh, Sebastian's kind of cool. Let's go, Sebastian. 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 Sebastian, Sebastian, is that, let's see. Can we get it again here? Oh, there it was. I missed it. Uh, it is, oh, there it is again. I think it has an A. <laughs> Any moment now. Jesus, we can name our kid Jesus. A good, good, good Catholic name. Okay, it definitely had an A, so let's just do this. Sebastian, may you grow so strong and wise, my son. Let's do it. 
Yeah, Giovanni's not bad. Ooh, Paolo. That's good too. We got we'll have other kids. There's we so we're we are twenty-eight. Our wife is thirty-two. So we're we're there's there's more kid opportunity here. It's it's gonna happen. She's terrified of us due to our dreadful reputation. Hmm. Ah, we can unlock a perk. Okay. Divine retribution. You do not lose piety or clergy opinion from torturing or executing others. Wow, that's handy. That's super handy. We can torture and execute people without losing piety? That's super handy. That's amazing. I like this tree. Wow. Oh, hey, we get bonuses for torturing people? Oh, because we're this is the torture tree here. Wow, okay, so we're working down to this. Huge. Alright. I mean I was not necessarily explicitly going for that, but it seems to have been filled in for me. Um let's see, schemer. Schemer is just giving me more scheme capabilities and the seducer, yeah. Okay. Alright. Oh, is there a neighboring ruler fighting the Pope here? Or is it, oh, the Pope won. Okay, the Pope, yeah, the Pope beat someone. All right, that's cool. to kill my Archbishop Herbert. That would be fine. That would be totally fine. Um, oh! We successfully swayed the Pope. That's awesome. Let's ask him for some money now. Hmm. Hmm. We don't have enough piety. Um. Wow. So, um, this is cool. Okay, also we get attentive care. That's cool. Um, yeah, so we actually would love someone to murder Herbert because he's not a very good bishop. So, like, if the Pope would put someone new here, that would be awesome. So let's just kind of leave that be. Hope someone else does our work for us there. The sun is shining and peasants are milling about the tourney hosted by my wife. On my night's cheer as Queen Theodora announces the tournament in her their honor, and for once I get to simply sit and watch. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Um every night gains 20 opinion of us. Yeah, that sounds great. Very nice. Very nice. Wow, and this guy's coming around to us. Excellent. Oh, available dynasty legacy. You have enough renown to unlock a dynasty legacy. Oh. Ooh, this is new. I haven't dealt with this before.
bounteous loins. Probably law. Yeah, that's very helpful. That'll let us rule our kingdom. But yeah, okay, let's unlock the law. Guys, okay, unlock mostly fair. Very nice. Huge achievement for us. Yeah, our marshal's super good. Everyone on our council's pretty good except for our bishop. Also, our wife is helping our marshal at this point, so that's that's contributing as well. How to pay for gold again. And yeah, 40. Yeah, that's great. Let's do it. Now let's use that gold to create the Duchy of Salerno. Done. Salerno, man. Gain a level of fame. We have too many duchies now, though, so yeah, we're gonna have to give. Give someone some duchies here. So what I'm thinking is there's that guy that doesn't really like us, that mayor, but he's close. He's close to liking us. Oh, this count doesn't like us anymore either. Oh, probably because we're holding too many duchies, maybe. Anyway, this mayor, I was thinking maybe we'd give him give him a little duchy. But so what's so this count? Well, he's already a count. This guy's only a mayor. So it would not make him that much more powerful to give him a Oh, we have to give him a count as well. From oh, that's right. Okay, so we have to we have to choose count. All right, all right. So what about this count that doesn't really like us that much right now? What if we were to give him the? So what is he? He's the count of Camarda. And Camarda is in the Duchy of Salerno. So if we gave him the Duchy of Salerno. I think we hold the yeah we hold the county of Salerno. Remain our vassal. Gain 60 opinion of us. Awesome, and we no longer worry about the duchy limit. So that's cool. Um, this guy is still annoying. Um, yes. Does he have a council position? His rules are power vessel who doesn't expect anything from you. That's nice. Wow, he just likes us. That's cool. Duke Rodrigo Vistorius has announced to the world that he and his vassals have converted to Nestorianism. Oh. Duke Rodrigo. Oh, okay. Sure. Whatever. Do what you do, Spain. Have fun over there.
Uh-oh. Our child is slow. And rowdy. Not good. This kid may be... This kid may be doomed. Again. I offered doubt my sincere thanks to these stairs angrily at me through a haze of alchemy. It was not easy to find someone to volunteer to test my collection of substances. For him, it has been an evening of pain, burning sensations, and, accord and occasional unconsciousness. Uh-oh. This has been most insightful. He loses 30 opinion of his ability. He doesn't like us that much. And experimental poisons. Hmm. We are not quite done yet. Oh wow, 15% chance of killing him. We gain risky experimental poisons, plus one intrigue. Nice. And he loses 50 opinion of us. Yeah, that's fine. He's not important. Sorry, Dowd. Oh no, I think we killed him. <laughs> oh no. Was poisoned by you on 30th of April, 1093. Age 67. Well, yeah, sorry, Dowd. He actually had pretty good. He was a good marshal, but... Um, we never quite... We actually were considering giving him some lands earlier. But it never quite worked out. So... It's alright. We used him to test some poisons, I guess. Oh, Pope loves us now. Loves us. Wife's getting better at strategy. That's cool. Malice implicit, dread gain per tyranny. Mm -hmm. It's not really what we want, but I think we want to keep going down this tree. That indiv that specific item won't help us that much. Yeah. A perfect little daughter, Elvira. Mm -hmm. Candida. Pretty good. Beata, Georgia, Giulia, Maura, Simuna, Chiara, Austina, Clemenza, Albina, Claudia, Virginia, Adriana. Oh, that's nice too, Adriana. I'm going to pause here because the name suggestions have been rolling in just slightly too late on previous kids. Calda, Christina. All right, Adriana, it is. Adriana. Now we have Otavia, 
Sebastian or an Adriana. Very nice. Okay. All babies cry, but with little Adriana, there's no end to the tears. I desperately want the midwife to ease my worries, but her fur and brow makes everything worse. The little lady is not getting weight as she should. We will take good care of her, my lord, but in the end, her life is in God's hands. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Adriana. Adriana's now sickly. We spent all the time naming her. Now her life's in, in death jeopardy. Recent communication, King Bishop Alexander the Papacy expressed a want to focus on his ambitions and interests more. Hmm. What is he like? Righteous Absolver. He's compassionate, forgiving, just. He's a philosopher, holy warrior, whole of body. And a scholar. Wow, he's pretty impressive. Send our kids to get educated by him. Wow. Um, yeah, nothing tastes him like a good book. I mean, he's super... Look at it. 35? 35 learning. That's insane. That's insane. I encourage my slight dip into more personal topics. Now I just have to keep pretending that I know anything about scholarship. Uh-huh. Give that a shot. Wow, he's he loves us now, although he's about to die. Seventy-five years old. Proposed alliance. King Kresimir of Croatia. Hmm. 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 Let's see, so what does she control? She controls all of that. Are they the people that went to war with us earlier? Also, that's territory I think we should take. But maybe we could ally with her against Pope. That yeah, could be cool. Take all this Pope land here. Love to take some Pope land. to maintain the ability to well let's see what sorts of like do we have the ability to declare war on her we do for let's see for something let's count robert's claims hmm yeah but they, have, they have more they have a larger army than we do and who are their existing allies? Bulgaria. Oh, do we not? Oh, we don't have the um, we don't have the Hungarian connection anymore because our we're now our son. So, uh, okay, then we should probably accept this. Oh, designated guardian for Atavia. Oh, the queen mother. We can designate our grandmother as the guardian. 
Let's see. She, well, she, no. She does not have good traits. We're not going to designate the grandmother. Uh, let's see. So what does Octavia do? She is pretty good at stewardship and learning. So, let's see. Who do we have? William Gifford. Not bad. Yeah, I think William Gifford. <laughs> Creeping suspicion. There's something odd about my guest, Lustina. I can't put my finger on it. Perhaps it's just my imagination. Uh, I should probably look into this. During my investigation, I have uncovered irrefutable proof. She is a non-believer. Oh. Huh. Okay, I can do it. Come to my attention, some local commoners are moving to Rome, the capital of the locals newly settled or not praising me can surely do no harm to his perception of me. Um, yeah, let's give him some money. I mean, the Pope loves us now. We don't necessarily need to sway him anymore. Fear tax. Should give us some nice money. Um... Okay, who in our realm do we need to sway? We need to sway... I mean, this guy's kind of a lost cause, but we can still try. Um, and then there's this guy who's not on the council. Should be good to stay ahead of swaying him. He's a pretty good steward. Could he be... Yeah, he's actually a better steward than Count Robert. Um, doo -doo -doo, let's see. Count Robert really likes us, but a lot of that is due to being on the council, I'm guessing. Oh, only 10. Yeah, but he'd be, I think he'd be minus 40. If we, so that'd be 50. We only need plus 22. Um... So a lot of these are temporary boosts, too, so. Okay, so that's probably not worth it. Because he would get pretty pissed about that. Okay, yeah, so let's go ahead and... Uh, Attempt to sway this guy instead. The Pope's on pretty good terms with us. Also, the Pope's about to die anyway, so. Our spy master had the priest brought forth for the revelation and judgment of a grand conspiracy. However, when the priest refused to confess, Duke Joffrey had absolutely no evidence to support for his accusations. Oh. Duke Joffrey not doing so hot over there. Gout ridden. Hmm. Oof, Joffrey costing us a lot here. Oh, 
Uh oh. Gain the trait ill. King or peasant, high or low, it doesn't matter. In the end, we are all mortals. I was reminded of this as I woke coughing in the early morning hours. A dull ache pounding through my head and throat. Oof. Uh, send for a physician now. Oh, we don't have a court physician right now. Uh oh. Didn't realize that. Okay. Finally, my servants found people. Antonia. 15. That's pretty good. Renowned physician. Very nice. And then we have this not very good person. So we will hire the good person. Uh, yes. Excellent. Okay. Time has come to treat your cold. While I'm fairly certain a simple tincture would suffice, the choice is yours, my lord. Do no more than is necessary, or um, a risky treatment. Um, yeah, let's let's do the safe safe right here. Antonio brought me a concoction made from buckthorn and senna. At first, I thought the push was ineffectual, but later the same day I felt the turning of my bowels, which sent me running for the privy. As I howled in anguish, Antonia assured me that Falonus was expelled with my feces. <laughs> in the end, the cleansing turned out to be just what I needed. For now, the worst of my symptoms are alleviated and the world seems a little brighter. Nice. There we go. That's awesome. That's the benefit of having a good physician. Oh, we're still ill, though. Hmm. We gained a... We gained a trait. Uh, reduced disease symptoms. Greetings. With the ongoing conflict between Duke Mikkeli and Duke Joffrey, I've been working tirelessly to get to the heart of their quarrel. I believe settlement can be reached. Oh, so we can either spend prestige or money here. Or we can let them keep fighting. Um, let's send prestige. D, it's been prestige, I think. We have more prestige than money right now. It's a well-known fact that courtiers will scheme and plot, and I'm able to use this to my advantage. If I keep my courtier, courtiers suspicious of each other and distracted with infighting, they will not have the time or resources to scheme against me. Hmm. Okay. Ah, place court spies. Yeah, that sounds better. evening of state business with Count Robert has slowly degenerated into both of us being deep in our cups, slurringly swapping saucy stories. I just finished my retelling of a tale of the seductive charms of some exotic sea monsters when I see an untoward gleam in my companion's eye. Thoughts of blackmail race unbidden to my mind. Perhaps Count Robert is actually a little keener on this subject than he knows. Interesting. Um, uh, let's see. Deviant secret. Or we go clo we grow closer to a friendship with him. Um, let's see. He already likes us. I think we could use a secret on him. Yeah, because then we can use that. So, 
We have a. We should have. A, oh, uh, what do we have? Okay. Yes, we know he's a deviant. Yes. Um. Oh wow, we can gain a we gain a strong hook on him. Woo! Huge. Okay. Will this will this hurt our? Will this hurt his relationship with us though? Well, let's see. Probably right. No. Oh, and we also got better. Saw rays of sunshine. Did not wake up coughing once. Excellent. We're in good shape now. Um, okay, and then Iustina. There's not really a strong reason to have a hook on Iustina. Although I guess we could use it to convert her, actually. So we go we blackmail her first. We gain the hook. Okay, yeah, so he does lose 15 opinion of us, but we, that's fine. That's we could we could still deal with that. And now we have a strong hook on him, which is like pretty crazy. Um, so we could we could raise his taxes to high. Kind of cool. Or his feudal levies to high. Yeah, let's go ahead. We can we can afford another fifteen for him. Okay, and then we get a blackmail on her, and what we're gonna use that to do is actually to uh No to I thought there was a way to for oh I think we have to get her into our court first. Okay. Then I think we can yeah, demand conversion, use a hook, demand conversion, there we go. Uh, a dark knight can truly make the shadows in the in my castle's hallways come alive. The perceived risk of unsanctioned visitors rise ever higher for every unguarded corner spotted. Hmm. Okay. Um. Yeah, let's hire some hire some agents. Oh. Cousin was killed. Okay, Damasu, an expert in the discreet arts, has been all over my castle, scaring both servant and courtier alike, but emerging from the darkest of corners. Huddled around his notes, a detailed plan for increased security is slowly taking form. Nice. Oh, we can get him to stay. Yeah, let's get him to stay. He's, he's probably pretty good, huh? Yeah, 16. Nice. Just hold on her. Oh wow, she's she's fine now. Loses the trait sickly. Very good. Very good. Oh, nice. We increased control of the county. Good.
Oh, our counselor. Oh, Lanciato died. Hmm. So, what does that mean? Oh, wow. Lost a lot of people here. Okay, so Marshall. Oh, I count Robert, clearly, although he's being, he's already the steward, but I think we have better stewards now, yeah. So, okay, let's reassign Count Robert to Marshall. Let's get a steward. Um, Duke McKelly. Yeah, he's a, he's a solid steward. And then let's get a spy master. Damasu is that guy that we convinced to stay. He's our brother. Oh yeah, this guy, remember the hunchback? He's got so many problems. Lover's pox, hunchback. He's a very good, um, very good elusive shadow though. Um, yeah, let's put him in there for now, I think. Oh, I guess Duke Joffrey, actually. Well, only 11, but... Uh, although, is he... He's severely injured. I mean, yeah, he's gonna die soon, so... You know, we don't need to... We don't need to deal with him. Hosting lords and ladies from realms near and far, some opportunities to portray my vassal Duke Joffrey in a good light have presented themselves. Oh. Sure. So close to positive with him.
Okay. Queen Theodora. Absent from our chambers. Oh no. Oh no. Front term. Or use the yeah, find secrets. Intrigue challenge, pretty good chance of success. Yeah, let's do an intrigue challenge. I found evidence. Oh no. Duke McKelly? What? Duke McKelly? How dare he? Forgive her. Much more advantages there. Well, his spouse is ill and has lover's pox, so I don't really blame him for branching out, but there's other people he could have gone after. Alright. Um. Oh no. Oh no. And now she. Oh no. Oh, this is terrible. Now our wife has lover's pox because she is involved with this other. Ugh. Venereal disease just spreading like wildfire here. Um, fertility minus 10,000. Uh huh. I forgive you. No, I'm not going to risk infection. Get out of my bed. Go away. Okay, well, we're not having more kids. That's, that's now confirmed. Um,. So, I mean, she was 41 anyway. But, so we got we got these three kids to work with. Um, the prince is lazy, rowdy, and slow. Oh, she's pregnant. Well, not with my kid, I'll tell you that much. Um, wow, what a disaster. It's just all... The home front's really falling apart here. Yeah, good point. I should I should find a an alternative lover here. Yeah, let's see what we got here. Um Count <sighs> Eustache. Thirty-one. His wife is twenty-nine. I could certainly find other people, but I don't know why I went straight to my vassal's wives. Um, could also just look at generally who's in my court. You know. Um, let's see. How about someone with a, like, a cool inheritable trait, you know? Oh, our court physician. Man, everybody has lover's box. <laughs> uh, let's see. Um, fit and sound of body. Yeah, see, she seems... Ah, oh, perfect, perfect. Okay, uh, let's, um, so seduce is versus romance. After romance, getting prestige, improving their opinion, possibly becoming soulmates. Whoa, no. No, we just want to seduce. Okay, look at that shot. 
library where books are stacked in corners. Unfinished building project all over the place. Most notably, a whole dining hall. The chest of gold just staying in the middle of the hallway. Duke Joffrey's castle is a mess. Mm, what do we have? We don't really... Are we good at any of these? We're good at Marshall. Is that a thing? No. Stewardship. No. These are all things we're bad at. Try helping with the dining hall. Nope, did not help. Okay. Let's try helping with the chest of gold. Uh, ah, okay, we helped him with the chest of gold. That's good. Let's try and help him with the books. Oh, also, Herbert died. New Archbishop! Yes! We have a new archbishop. I hope he's good. Oh no, he's also terrible. Why does the Pope keep appointing these really bad bishops? They're all really bad. And this and we gotta we gotta sway this guy to our side all over again. Let's just send him a gift. There we go. Welcome to the welcome to the family, dude. Um Oh, he loses his opinion of us because we messed up his house. Not great. Yeah, I do like the idea of mounting a Catholic insurrection. Uh, Troubadour will soon perform in the court of Messina. Yes. Um, 51% chance. That's not great. Okay, let's see. Hope for the best. Oh, no. Okay, she didn't like us. Alright, that's not going well. Okay, let's find someone else to seduce. Uh, why is Garda Spartanos? What's she got? She's legitimized bastard. She's got decent traits. Oh, she's betrothed to a, a blind guy, I guess. Could work out. I think we should try and attract some claimants to our court and hope we get someone cool. Oh, 750 prestige, though. That's a lot. Um, okay, let's hold a feast at least. Welcome, friends. Refilling a tightly grasped glass for the third time since joined since joined by their spouse. A relationship on the brink of collapse. Lady on the other side of the hall is wearing the same bits as yesterday. Financial troubles. Everyone is hiding something. With a practiced eye, even the smallest details will show you the full picture. All right, sure, yeah, let's go. The feast was a success. Okay, everyone gains opinion of us. We gain some prestige. Always helpful. Uh, okay, so this is the sun. 
theoretically. Never know. Uh, that red hair. Clear, clear tip off of that red hair. Um, never know. Okay, uh, let's... <laughs> let's call this... <laughs> Call his son uh, Bastardo. <laughs> um, may you grow strong and wise, Bastardo. Prince Bastardo of Sicily. Very good. Very skeptical of Bastardo. Okay. Uh, Countess Villaslava's windows are lit by a warm glow, and even from the ground, I can see movement inside. Pulse thrums loudly in my ears, both courting the chance to better as well as visiting Trani. Has left me in deep waters. Hmm. Up I go. What does she think of us these days? Plus 36, that's not bad. Did it work? Oh, renewed jihad. The House of Islam is under grave threat. What's this game doing? Oh no, that's the Caliph. Oh dear. Oh, look at this little guy. Uh, is under grave threat from the onslaught of heathens and infidels in its very heartlands in response to the magnificence. Caliph Khalid has declared the era that it, this guy has declared that an era of renewed jihad is upon the world. The core regions of the Dar al Islam must be retaken at all costs. Okay. St. George protect us. Uh, yeah, from this little dude. We'll be fine. Okay, what? As soon as I reach her balcony, she screams to her guards, help an intruder. <laughs> this seduction is not going well. <laughs> yeah, we need to we need to find a new a new target here. Uh, <laughs> Alright, who else has, has wives that we can now see? She's got the lover's pox. Everyone's got the lover's pox. We need to find you find someone clean. Let's see. Ooh, this guy that doesn't like us. What about his spouse? Craven, diligent, compassionate. She's terrified of us. Uh, she's 52, though. Okay, never mind. Never mind. Okay. Uh, 34. Countess Sibylla of Foggia. Uh, nope. She has lover's pox. Everyone's got lover's pox. Um, I guess it is an option to just get rid of my wife and then marry again. Yeah. Yeah. And then I could get, I could form an alliance or something cool like that. Yeah. Um,. Yeah, yeah. I mean, she's she's quite messed up at this point. Uh, um, so murder scheme. Oh wow, very good chance of success. Ninety-five percent. Whoo! All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, Countess Veloslava's reaction to my advances tell me everything I need to know. The time has come for my plan to action. No, I switched this. I'm not doing this anymore. She doesn't, she's not going for it. Uh, it's reached maximum progress. I mean, it has a very low chance of success. I'm gonna say I cannot risk discovery. Yeah, I'm just gonna abandon that. We've, we've got a new plan now. Secret exposed. Although there's no way to conclusively prove it, my niece, Queen Ildiko, has brought forward evidence that Ildiko is not the daughter of King Laszlo of Hungary. Alright, whatever. Whatever. That's, that's, you know, they can sort that out. Okay. 
Even to see my wife dead has been discovered. What? There was like a 5% chance of that. Oh no. This is all a big misunderstanding. Uh, wow. All of this is an act of tyranny. Um, wow. Crazy. Yeah, well, if we'd invest in this in the seduction tree here, I feel like we would have uh, we'd have done better with that other plan. Hmm. Should we just like straight up try it again? No, I guess we can't. Ah. Hmm. Wow. Well, that's too bad. Oh, I can lawfully imprison Letiza. Guardians, yeah, let's do some of that. Okay. Faction created against me. Hmm. Oh, well, this guy. Yeah, that's fine. Um, that's fine. Zero percent chance of success. deal with uh, we have to deal with our children that need yes that need guardians okay so this is our son and heir right now yeah and we really would like to give him someone with learning I think because he's super dumb um, so let's send him to Antonia here and then this is our daughter this is our daughter um and what does she have stewardship she's good at stewardship Sure, yeah. William Gifford. Love it. <laughs> Tidbits from far away. Visiting the local market, a merchant from a faraway land catches my attention. Come closer, my lord. Marvel at treasures never before seen in these lands. How to watch my back to get these beauties out. Hmm. Cool. Not gonna win that. Um. Yeah, okay. 
spend some money there. Okay, Councilor Robert died. Man, it's not good. That's not good at all. Um, well, this mayor is okay. Uh, not amazing. Duke Joffrey. Well, we could resolve his problem with not being on the council. But he's not great. He's only nine. And he's, like, almost dead. Um... Huh. Oh, this guy seems cool. Yeah, who's this Vasily guy? Recruit him to court. Yeah. Yeah. Put him there. He's super good. Love it. Okay. Oh, so we can finally unlock Torturer, which will give us prowess, dread gain, hostile scheme resistance, and levy size increase. So that's awesome. Cool. Heard whisper and sharp glare at the f are the final pieces that make the puzzle fall into place. My spy master Damasu is more well versed in the art of intrigue than he would have everyone believe. Um, I'll convince him that we are cut from the same cloth. Yeah, I have the in intrigue lifestyle perk. Yeah, let's, let's go. It takes many days, but I coincidentally stumble upon him while I was alone. you walked into a room to find your spouse yelling at a young page for dropping a plate, what would you do? Your spouse yelling at a young page for dropping a plate. Okay, we got a, we got a riddle here, basically. He's generous and shy. So, um, I mean, maybe this, I would leave as fast as possible if he's shy. Zealous. Avoid interacting with other people. Yeah, I think so. So it's definitely not this conversation thing. And then maybe I'm sure they can handle it better without me. try this. Hmm. In the middle of a march to battle, just as you are setting up camp, an officer approaches you to ask what should be done with a spy that has been caught. Okay, make an example. Make sure the spy is treated well. Obviously, the spy has some answers because given time. Okay, so again, so we have, I mean, generous, right? So, um, generous. I'm going to say make sure it's treated well because he's generous. So that's probably... He nods to himself. 
You make a decision and say that all taxes and accounting will be raised. And it comes to your attention that one of your vassals openly questions that decision. How do you react? Um, definitely not confront them loudly. And I don't think so by discussion either. He doesn't really do that. He's shy. With all of our differences, it wouldn't bother me. His face is lit up by a surprisingly warm smile. You seem to be a man of sound judgment. He blushes before moving down the corridor on silent feet. Please join me. We have much to discuss. Nice. He becomes our mentor. Cool. Got us a perk. That's nice. Okay. Schemer. Truth is relative. Able to fabricate hook scheme. That's cool. That's, that's handy. And this helps us do schemes. So that's, yeah, that's nice. This helps us do the seduction thing, which we already kind of failed at. I think we're just gonna, at this point, try and just murder our wife. So, which is more, leads more to the schemes lifestyle here. This time for real, uh, can we, is this up again? Ooh, we can fabricate a hook on her. Um, can't try and murder her again until 111 AD. Wow. That's forever from now. Okay, had some horse racing things to do there. They're now done. Um, okay, so we can try and fabricate a hook. I don't know if that's, like, will that help us murder her though? I don't think so, that'll help us imprison her. But, whatever. Uh, um, yeah, let's keep, keep it rolling here. 
Oh, I can imprison Duke Joffrey? What did he do? Murdered a family member. Oh, interesting. Uh... Okay, we're going for the eight here, Nickel Curve, and Los Alamitos Race 1. Let's see how that works out. Um, I don't really want to imprison Duke Joffrey. I'm going to leave that as is. Okay. The sun is shining. Pens are milling about the tourney hosted by my wife. All my knights cheer. And yes, we gain a bunch of opinion from our knights. That's awesome. That's always helpful. Oh, nice. Get some extra taxes. Daddy Rabbit just blowing away the field there. Two horse. Huge. Wow. All right. Uh, let's see here. Sister Emma died. Hmm. to see my daughter no longer as a child but as an adult okay natural inclination towards scholarship um, an avid learner she's been quite the purveyor of knowledge okay awesome astute intellectual ooh I like it um, let's see so is there 
have her be educated by our four-year-old. Oh, no, it's we're having someone be educated by her. Okay, got it. No, that's not what we want. Um, uh... Okay, let's see if we can find something cool here. Mm. Nothing huge here. she can marry, but there's not really anyone out there right now. Most Serene Republic of Venice. Ooh, that's a cool alliance. Yeah, let's ally with Venice. There we go. Okay. This will help us in our war against the Pope. Having Venice on our side. Oh, we could also just request a divorce. We don't actually have to murder our wife. Um, we spend 100 piety. She loses opinion of us, but whatever. All her family members lose opinion of us. Yeah, I think that's worth doing. All right, let's do that. Okay, it is well-known fact that courtiers will scheme and plot, but I may be able to use this to my advantage. Um, yes, begin spreading rumors. Or court spies. Yeah, court spies. I want to be resistant to schemes. Uh, after much prayer and deliberation, I've decided to grant your request to divorce your wife on grounds of adultery. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Thank you, Pope. Very helpful. Okay. Uh, oh, and I that got me a perk. Ooh, could have used that earlier. Uh, murder scheme power plus 30%. Nice. Unlock that. Okay, who else is out there here? That's the question. Uh, what do we got? We've got... Someone who's possessed. Interesting. Duchy of Luxembourg. Oh no, bleeder. Oh, 
Oh, Kingdom of Sweden. That's an alliance. Oh, she's 11 years old. Duchy of Barcelona. Yeah, this probably makes the most sense here. Arrogant deceitfulness. Okay, so she's not she, she's not a great person. Um, but she's only 31. Where are we? 42. She's um, we'd ally with Luxembourg. She's got some claims, which are cool. Um. Just a little worried about her traits. And what can she contribute? She's good steward, good intrigue. And she's a lunatic. Hmm. Not sure about that one. Eglantine's a bleeder, we know that. Uh, Beata would ally us with some random county. Uh, she's paranoid, craven, and content. Hmm. That would be, yeah, we would get minus 100. is not great. Hmm. Not, yeah, not a ton of, not a ton of great options here. Let's see. Well, so here, uh, adult. Let's do an adult, and then let's do alliance power. Uh, Ermeso de Barcelona, 44 though. Hmm. Okay, let's just look at age increasing. Kind of Swinnick. Impatient, diligent, trusting. That's not bad. She's 16. We will get minus 100. How is Chance Children medium? Seems like there's a pretty large chance. She's 16, we're 42. Um, do, do, do. Prestige gain. Maria Landolfini, impatient, shy, and greedy. County of Capua. That's not bad. Look, we both gain a ton of prestige. Not a super powerful alliance, but that's fine. Oh, we were related, and there's a risk of our children being inbred. Oh, that's not great. Mm. Not great. And what was the problem with Beata? I think it's just that we're going to lose prestige. We can we can afford to lose 100 prestige. Uh, and what? She's 23. Paranoid, craven, content, and charismatic negotiator. Be able to help us with the diplomacy front. And chance the children is medium. And decent alliance, not amazing. Okay, let's just do that. It is what it is. Okay, great. Hey, you got an achievement for that. Marry another character. Very good. Okay. Um, and now we've got to make sure she's doing the right thing on the council here. So let's, let's see. She's great at diplomacy and learning. Um, our bishop could sure use some help on the learning front. Uh, 
I think she. I think let's help with the chancellor though, because then it'll just be like superpowers here. That's great. All right, very good. And I will be right back. Drink refill.
Okay. Um, so, uh, went through several different ideas on what to drink there, and then settled on something to celebrate uh, Italy here. We have a um, uh, we have an espresso. Mm. Mm. Vanilio. Delightful. Tastes great. Um, okay. So. Mm -hmm. Alright, where were we? So we just married. Wedding celebration. The realm expects us to throw a suitably extravagant wedding. It is well within my rights to collect a royal aid duty as part of this, but some may consider it tasteless. Um, who pays for their own wedding? Oh no, let's, um, yeah, let's gain some prestige. Love it. My son Sebastian is more likely to receive a good education due to Queen Beata's tutelage. Nice. Um, I've been hosting your Chancellor, Count Eustish, for two, several weeks. He's helped me truly see the splendor of the realm under your rule. Nice. Nice. Wow. He loves us. Let's create some more men-at-arms here. Why not? We got money now. that not work? There we go. Salamidas race two. So we are looking for the six horse to come through here. Also known as Son of a Queen. Looking for Son of a Queen. Okay. Um, let's see. Uh oh. My what? What? The wife I just married is ill with consumption? Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, let's see. Um Yeah, drastic measures. That sound good. There will be no treatment. Choice stuff my wife. Um no, I think we're gonna go drastic measures. It's consumption. Um uh, Oh look at that six horse! Let's go. Let's go. Son of a queen. Son of a queen. Oh, son of a queen looking good. Make it happen. Let's go. Woo! Pulling away. Pulling away. Not even close. Son of a queen by, by like three lengths, four lengths. Huge. That was our single. So now we're cruising in this pick four. Ah, oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Love it. Okay, uh, let's do drastic measures in life here. Awesome. Um, okay, let's see. So, we're just waiting for our wife to get better, hopefully. Don't think she's gonna be, um, having a lot of kids in, um, her... Oh, is she... Wait, is she better? Yeah, I'm not seeing any... Uh, Sebastian comes of age. Oh, here we go. Here's our son and heir. 
current error. This is the guy that's uh, slow. It's a good elusive shadow, though. Proud to see my son no longer a child, but as an adult. Um, now it's hard to say, however, everything that is tasked with him is done by others before he gets to it. Yeah, so he's, yeah, he's not great. Um, but let's marry him. Let's see, well, we could marry him for an alliance, but I kind of want to, I kind of want to have another kid and then disinherit him. Um, well, we have Bastardo here. Um, uh, Bastardo is curious. That's a good start. Hmm. Well, there aren't that many good options here anyway. Let's see. County of Colon. Duchy of... Oh, we could marry him to the person we were potentially going to marry. Why didn't we end up doing that? Um. Oh. Uh, well, no. His He's bringing the slowness. Um. Forget. Hmm. Well, let's let's sort this by alliance power here. What do we? Oh, that is okay. Sophia Jacques, paranoid, content, compassionate. That's not bad. Oof! Wow, he would lose a lot of prestige. Yeah, because she's just like a random random person. She's not. She doesn't even really have like a title or anything. Rank Countess Anna. He would still lose. Yeah, so I think let's just keep him unmarried for now. Oh, hey, look at that. Our wife is pregnant. Nice, she's doing great. Duke Vladimir of Duke La, Duke Cha, has announced the world that he and his vassals have converted to Catharism. Having become disillusioned with the teachings of the Catholic priests, the nobles of Duke La no longer consider the clergy to be righteous and true. As Cathars, they believe their new faith properly aligns with the will of God, and they are distancing themselves from their former religious institutions. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, we can let them do that. Okay, we have a daughter. Um, Clemenza, Livia, Damiana, Colella, Bona, Lucina, Pulcera, Genovra, Cecilia, August Augusta, Augusta, Alessia, Elvira, Filippa, Bona, Maria, Lucina, Olympia. Oh, that's kind of cool, Olympia. Olympia. But daughters are we're most looking for another but we have I guess we have Bastardo, so we could just lean on Bastardo here, and he seems to be doing alright. Um He's you know, he's a bold altruist, that's cool, and he's curious.
Alessia, Count William's sister is firmly in my grip. However, with the right strategy, I might raise my upper hand even further. Perhaps Alessia could extend my influence over the court. Alessia. Um... Let's see. Intrigue challenge to find evidence of his secrets. Or... Uh, intrigue challenge... Oh, or an intrigue challenge against her. Uh, to kill... Oh. Weird. Oh, wow. We're gonna, we could kill her and make it look like he did it? Wow, that's crazy. Um, spread a few rumors about how terrifying I am. No, okay, I like this. So we're gonna, we're gonna use her to uncover his secrets, yeah. Unless I could find no incriminating information. Hmm, okay. Okay, so we can either get, either learn of his secret, or we can get a weak hook. Yeah, let's go ahead and get a weak hook on him. Let's see, can we use that immediately to modify the feudal contract? Wow, his contract is already high. We could modify his contract to extortion it. <laughs> um, I mean, yeah, we got all these hooks. Might as well use them. <laughs> Tax the shit out of him. <laughs> Sorry, William. Oh, intrigue, lifestyle, perk available. Job done right. Hostile scheme success chance. Sure. Uh, air unmarried. Yep, more of that. Uh, designated guardian for Bastardo. This is important because this may be this may be the kid that we're depending upon here. So he's curious. He's good on yeah learning. So I think we're gonna actually send him to the same to the court physician because uh, she's super badass on the yeah 15. Yeah. So I think we send him to her as well. She doesn't have any like atrocious traits so. That's fine. Her son's still looking to marry. Um, there's just no one really out there uh, that's, you know, that's that's impressive. It's the problem. Wife's pregnant again. Big. William died. Oh, he was Adriana's educator. Okay. Let's find another... Oops, no, not a spouse. Uh, let's find another... Uh, oops, no, let's... Yeah, educate child. And... So, let's see. She's pretty good at martial, stewardship, and intrigue. So, what about someone who's really good at marshalling? Um... Oh, Princess Theodore of the Byzantine Empire. Oh, she'll gain 15 opinion of me. Oh, that's cool. Oh, I guess if you send them to people in other empires, that's when it becomes like they get they they gain opinion of you. That's cool. Okay, let's do that. Um Oh right, Princess Theodora. That's our ex-wife. <laughs> Whoops. Uh well, maybe we should. Yeah, maybe we should move. We're gonna move her elsewhere here. I did not. I didn't not realize what I was doing there. Um, let's see. What's up with this? This Marshall Sky. Okay. What about stewardship? Maybe. Let's take a look at that. Oh, we could send her to Damasu. Or, I mean, this guy's just 
great here. Cynical, vengeful. Yeah, well. Marshall. Yeah, okay. Let's send her to Vasily. All doing useful stuff here. I suppose so. All right. Court politics. Uh, oh yeah, right. That's fine. Um, boosting him. Yeah. Is that what she's good at? She's good at. Yeah, she's good at diplomacy. That's right. Okay, we're good. Emerging lunacy. Lately, I have a hard time thinking straight. My thoughts are scattered like clouds upon a summer sky. The birds outside my window have started singing another tune. Other people seem to willfully talk in riddles, and no one acknowledges that cilantro is a truly horrid spice. Wait, what was I thinking about? Weird. That... Oh, yep, that's what I was thinking. Okay, yeah, I figured we'd gain something. We gained the trait lunatic. Hmm. Emerging lunacy. That's not good. The woman in the clouds understands me, but the shadows are reaching further every day. That's not going to be good. So, lunatic. Yeah, like, people are going to start not liking us. Um. Hmm. So, let's see. So, we could, um. Uh. I thought there was a way to commit suicide. Um, uh, maybe not. Oh, right, it was over here, I think. It was in Indecisions. Yeah, attempt suicide. Um, it could be useful. All vassals lose 30 pin of me. Well, but I'm gonna be gone, so it doesn't matter. Uh, we decrease our dynasty's level of splendor. We die. Yeah, that's not great. Let's host a feast instead. Master Garden Great Hall, what is bright? Welcome, friends. Love hosting feasts. Good time. Uh, let's see. Another daughter. Wow, so many daughters. Luisa, Luigi, Giacinta, Dominica, Adelia, Casualda, Isabella. Isabella will work. Uh, okay. Start as an ordinary feast became an exceptional one thanks to the presence of Mayor Roberto. He spoke all evening about all manner of subjects and as things would have, have it, seemed to have a lot in common. Okay, cool. Form a friendship with him, I guess. Yep, nice. Uh, I'm concerned with any etiquette 
asshole slaps me on the back. I mean it. I'll do anything you ask of me. Anything at all. Uh, you're a man of your word, aren't you? We could get a weak hook on him. Or we could increase his opinion on us. Uh, no, let's get a weak hook on him. Yeah. Now let's turn right around. Modify our feudal deal with him. Uh, oh, he doesn't have, a, I guess, a mayor. Does a mayor not have a... Uh, doesn't have taxes. With everyone headed for their respective homes, proud to say the fees was a success. Okay, very good. Um, e a reveler. People gain opinion of us. It's great. It's fantastic. Forget about the fact we're a lunatic. We've got so many other good things going on, like this feast, that we're good. Head of our dynasty again. That's helpful. Our wife is pregnant again. And we mismanaged development in Salerno. Gotta take the good with the bad. Another daughter, wow. All right. Uh, I call her so many, uh, <laughs> or uh, too many, uh, <laughs> too many. Uh, <laughs> too many kids going on here. Oh, name suggestion came in late again. Too late. She's too many now. Uh. I mean, it has been a pleasure to be your guest here in Sicily. You Stathia stammers. Uh, let's see. She is betrothed to Adrianos. Some random dude. All right. I got to meet you. That only made me stay worth it. I beg you, will you spend a night of passion with me before I leave? Wow, she's just, just very upfront with it. Um, yeah, okay, cool. Well, we could always use more air, more potential heirs here. Um, let's see, um, we could try and make her reveal my vassal's secret, um, or we could have her curry relationship with, uh, Eustache, no, we're okay with him, um, Um, let's see. Well, we're going to lay with her in any case. So it's really just what we want to get out of it. Um, yeah, and let's try and also get a an intrigue challenge. Nice. Um, we learned a secret as well, so that's great. So now we can take that. And we can... 
Um, uh, Lucrezia. It's the illegitimate child of Duke Michelli. Ah, okay. So, does that, can we get something out of Duke Michelli for that? Yeah, blackmail. Child's heritage. See if we can gain a hook here. We did, excellent. He likes us so much. Um, oh, because we gave him a duchy, that's right. Yeah, well, let's just keep modifying these feudal contracts. <laughs> We're getting so many good taxes here, so many goods. Oh, special contract. They present more tax than what their, oh, our culture doesn't permit that. March, March contract. While subject to a March contract, the vassal will receive bonuses to their levies and pension capabilities, but provide 50% less tax. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, we want more tax. They've already been changed. Well, yeah, but I want to change them again. Hi. Use a hook. Okay, wait, what? They've been changed. What does that have to do with anything? Huh. Proud to see my daughter no longer a child, but as an adult. Um, cool. Um, I wish I could modify this guy's feudal contract. Oh, you can only change the feudal contract once for each character. Oh, wow. Hmm, weird. All right. They grow up so fast. Okay, so we gotta find a spouse for her. Um, so she is, let's see, cynical, calm, brave, thrifty. Count Odakar of Murjand. Is this an alliance? He's 16, like she is. And he's a count, which is cool. Um, yeah, that's fine. Send her away. Oh, Los Alamitos three. What do we got here? Los Alamitos three, we got the one, two, four, or six. One, two, four, or six. Castle Gate doing really well. That won't be much of a price though. Castle Gate is just running away with it. Yeah, Castle Gate's got this. All right, well, not much of a price there, but at least we're still alive for the pick four. Need a two, four, or six to win in race four. And then we're gonna be good on the pick four. Could be big. Okay, good. Accept the marriage proposal. Nice. Um, and let's see, Court of Shadows, digging for dirt. Yeah, digging for dirt. All right, we should also think about, like, you know, taking Napoli or something, you know? This guy. Sure. They're inferior, but that's probably counting how much of alliances we have. Um, yeah. Um...
Yeah, I think let's try and let's go ahead and say, seize the county of Napoli. Yeah, we're taking Napoli, baby. We're taking it. army first here if we can. Also, let's see if we can call at least one ally in here. So, like, Venice, maybe? Um, ooh, green for prestige. There's a lot. Gold, only 75. Is there strength? 1505. Venice has to be pretty close, you would assume. Uh, although sometimes it's weird. But that's going to be really expensive, so we don't want that anyway. This Mercial Log is over there, so that could be worth calling in. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and call him in too. Uh, just in case here. Oh, we call a house member. Of Strasbourg into our war. Oh, cool. Okay, sure. Let's do that too. Okay. Now we're, we've got a lot of. Now we've, we're doing very well. So. Looks like he's heading over here. Something like that. Let's see. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Great, great, great. This is bad. You will lose decisively. That's not good. Let's go here instead. Great. Use those reinforcements pretty soon. Okay, so we're sieging them. They are sieging us. Um, and we just gotta hope that uh, our allies come through soon enough. Where are they these days? Uh, oh no. And, um, Holy War for the County of Messina. Great. Okay, we may want to hire a mercenary troop here. Um, So long to get here. That'd be a problem. Um, all right, let's hire some mercenaries. is even better though. Now let's go with this guy.
Three months. Two months. Hmm. Perhaps we should go back and save this town here. Uh, potential better chances are even. All right. Well, let's see. Oh, they're retreating here. Interesting. Come on, let's go. Nice. Uh oh. Uh, King or peasant hireling doesn't matter. We're under the weather. Okay. Um, no more than what is necessary. Yep. Trying to enter my chambers, and we did some leech leech action here. Um, and uh, that was great. It worked out really well. Fantastic. Okay, very good. And now our allies actually are already sieging them, so that's that's quite nice. Um, oh, Gomez endorses me. Nice. Oh, my counselor died. Hmm. Oh, here we go. These are the, these are those other dudes that decided to declare the holy war or whatever. Great. So my allies are just kind of wrecking Napoli over there. That's good. And then we're gonna come and repel these holy war people here. Yeah, we got him. We got him. Nice. My glory is widely known. Excellent. Winning all these battles. Hopefully taking a bunch of prisoners. We can only hope. Um, no, I guess not. Oh, and a few knights. We need to invite some knights. Oh, I can call him into the holy war as well. Sure, why not? Because I think we're gonna need to, oh, look at this, the Malta here. Gotta get out there. Meanwhile, our allies, you can ass over here. Looking really good. Okay, we're sieging that. Wow, wife's pregnant again. Huge, lots happening. Okay, we're no longer ill. It's handy. We're, I think, about to win this war, hopefully. Oh, cool. Yes. No, no, that was the Holy War. Okay. Great, on that Holy War. Assuming that's this other war is pretty close too here. Yep, there we go. Now police under control. Force demands. Force demands. Got it. Okay, Napoli is now under our control. Excellent. Really good.
Okay, and he's now our vassal. Let's see what he thinks of us. Um, oh, this guy would be a pretty good marshal, actually. We should put him on the council. Yeah. Um, let's see. Yes, the Napoli guy does not like us. Perks. Love it. Enables the abduction scheme. Nice. We're going to now abduct the, this guy. Yes. <laughs> that could be cool. Ah, perfect little daughter. Man, keep having these daughters. Non-stop daughters here. Um. All right, what was the, we had, a, we had a female name suggestion here, which was Rosalie, Rosalie. Rosalie it is. Okay, um, let's see. Well-known fact that courtiers will scheme and plot, but I'm able to use this to my advantage. No, I don't really like put it, pitting them against each other. Let's just do the court spies again. Okay, all that's left is the is the papacy here. Papacy, papacy. Take on that. I, we probably have a way to declare war on the Pope. Yeah, we do. Um, yeah, to seize... Uh, what? To seize the county of Capua. That one there, yeah. I mean, that, that would... Probably not worth it to... Just for that one county. Alright, Arishu... Oh, wait. Yeah, what's, the, what's the Pope's military? 5,000. Yeah, that's not great. We would probably lose that. Um, okay, with the right strategy, I may raise my upper hand even further. Perhaps a ratio could be used to extend my influence over the court. What's up with this guy? Scaly. Hmm. Um. Some secrets. I mean, we just have so much on Count William. So much. I think we already have a hook, don't we? No, I guess we don't. Oh, it might have expired, actually. Um, oh, what? yeah, I mean, we have a strong hook on him here. I don't, I don't think we can modify his contract anymore because we've already, yeah. So we actually can't really do that much with him. Um,
Nice. He's now our friend. Oh, we're already at extortionate. All right, that's right. <laughs> yeah, we don't really need to. Oh, mercenary company contracts expiring. Yeah, that's fine. We can leave them as is. Oh, raid raiders. Hmm. Well, we can fix that pretty easily. It's kind of annoying though. Don't stand a chance. Um, oh, are we going to be constantly raided for four months? Hmm. It's not great. Okay, there's that mercenary company. Oh, good, we increased county control. That's nice. Um, control, 93, 85, so we could probably use some in Salerno. Yeah, okay, let's go Salerno here. Up in, or oh. In, oh, in Napoli, even more important. Yeah, that's right. The recently captured one. Finished reading the latest letter from my vassal count in Mel Smile. He seems to have warned me at last. Oh, nice. Look at this. Um, we have a 72% chance of an additional 20. Yeah, let's give it a shot. Oh, failed. At least he's positive on us now. That was a long journey to get this guy to like us. Curried a bunch of favor with you. Oof. Large gift. Hmm. Actually, let's see if we can send him a large gift, which will increase it by a ton. There we go. Then, actually, we're going to pivot to. Our scheme, we can sway this guy instead. Yep, we're gonna come back to this guy now that he likes us. We're gonna try and get him to convert. 39%. Not great. Um, let's give it a shot. He converted! That's awesome! Okay, fantastic. He's now Catholic. Very cool. Okay. Yeah, that really turned things around there. And now I assume that he will abandon the his support for this faction. I'd have to assume. He really likes us now. Uh, yep, there he goes. He's gone. Okay. Independence demand. Well, oh, he left right after this finally succeeded. Okay. It's time to recognize the full independence of Napoli. No, I just conquered Napoli. I'm clearly not going to recognize your independence. No. No, I mean, we can go to war again if you want. Yeah, that's the thing we can do. Uh, um, oh, I guess I, yeah, I can't sway him anymore now that I'm at war with him. That does make some amount of sense. Um, 
Can I fabricate a hook on him though? Probably. No, I can't. Oh, I can't. Or abduct him. Fabricate a hook on him. Uh, okay, and then let's raise our armies right here. <laughs> that, that army was coming down here and then it noped out and went this way instead. That's good. You will probably lose. Hmm, I don't like that. I have more people by a lot. I guess they're pretty skilled though. member in again. Yep. Let's give this a shot. Oh, no, no, what's happening? More minute arms counter. Ah, uh, I see. Yeah, I guess we should spend more time upgrading these folks. Well, let's give this a shot, though, still. I mean, they're clearly afraid of us because they keep, like, dodging us here. Shadows unlock. Heck, we're sieging now. Yeah, 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 they're coming in here. But I think I can get this before they get this. And this is like their only city. So it should bring us right to 100%. Yeah, and then we just end the war immediately. We imprison him. That's nice. Very good. Very good. Okay. This man. Captured his daughter. Okay. Siege one. No longer increase control in county. Oh, because it's now... Do we now control it? Or no? Oh, okay. Can we just seize this from him? Can we just, like, revoke title? Um, oh, I do not have limited crown authority or better. That's right. Uh, let's see. What do you, uh, can I do that? Yeah, let's give it a shot. People are going to start to like us less, but he's imprisoned anyway. And we'll try and sway this guy. Um. And yeah, now we can hopefully revoke his title. Yep, County of Napoli will accept. Um, he's a known criminal, so we can we don't, are not viewed as a tyrant if we revoke his title. And um, he gets a claim on it. That's fine. He ain't gonna take it. Great. Okay, Napoli is now ours directly. That's awesome. He will stay in prison. That's great too. We will send our marshal in to increase control because it's probably a little bit rowdy there right now. Uh, yep. Uh, yep. He's yep, just a random dude now. No titles. He's playing Monopoly. I mean, he played his cards really poorly there. We got a little Salamunas action here. Hey, who we got, who we got, who we got? We are looking for... Two, four, or six? Looks like the six. I think that's the six. Maybe. We're 
looked like it. Let's see. Focusing on the five a little bit. Hope not. Replay. I've got a good start there. And what, then the six comes up at the end here? Wow, that's a lot of ground to make up. Look, the quarter horses are so fun. That was close. Whoa! Wow! Woo! We hit the pick four. We hit the pick four. Yeah. Not gonna, not gonna pay a ton though, because yeah, three favorites. Still, though. Taking care of that. Children lack guardians. Oh, hmm. okay. Um, let's see. You're pretty good at intrigue. Who do we have there? We have, we have a spy master. Very good at intrigue. Oh, we have Prince Sebastian. Hmm. Yeah, he's quite good too. Bella is kind of even across the board. Rowdy, Marshall, and Intrigue. So let's take a look at Marshall. What do we got? Nobody who's great. Um, well, here, let's send her to Sebastian, which is kind of cool. Although, yeah, I think we should probably try and... Um, should probably try and educate more of our children across, like, in other nations and stuff, because I think it does help us form stronger bonds with other other leaders, but I'm not sure. So there's a lot of activity going on. These, like, just, you know, are, we've got a lot of infighting happening that I'm not a huge fan of. Bad. Forty-six thirty. Came to my attention that some local commoners are moving to Lucera, the capital of my vassal, Count William. Locals newly settled or not praising me can surely do no harm to his perception of me. Let's go ahead and give him some gold.
Oh, diplomat. Nice. Wow, she's doing great. See, what is this? Like, this is our territory. Like, it's just, you know, there's some... Like, what's, what, who's... Stop this. Ooh, I can construct some buildings. Should do that. Oh, I'm behind on constructing buildings. Duchy building. Hmm, takes money. I don't have money right now. So I will not construct buildings. Hey, William likes us again. Which is good, because we're extorting the hell out of him. Plus 25% taxes. Love it. Twist, of, uh, twist and turns of fate have not always been to my advantage. God knows that I was cursed the day I met Pandolf. My rival. Uh, oh, no. Oh, great. My rival died. I guess very good. Okay, stress free over here. Still a lunatic, which is not great, you know, but benefits from spouse's tutelage. Nice. Okay, looks like they stopped the infighting, which is good. Wow. Count William loves us now. Face for gold. Does he like me? He does. He likes me quite a bit. Um, yes. Let's go do that. Designated guardian for too many. Uh, um, let's see. Yeah. Let's see, I think. See. Yeah. I mean, let's pick like. Um, I don't know. Uh, uh, you know, over here. Where are these people? Duchess Lavorka. Is this all her land? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, so what about her? So, like, how about... Oh, we can declare war on her? Oh, nice. Uh, that's not what we want to do, though. We wanted to... Like, what if we... Personal... Yeah, like, offer ward. You know, so what if we're, like, Princess Tumenia? Is... What if she comes and is, is like, your ward? How would that work out? Let's see. Yeah, so she would gain 15 opinion of us. That's nice, right? That's helpful. And our child goes over there, and it's like, cool. Is she good, though? 
must be ruling little thing here. Yeah, humble, forgiving, temperate, and true. Perfect, perfect. Send her over. There we go. We now see how we should not go to war with them or whatever. Because um, they have our daughter. Although it's it's too many. We don't care that much about too many. And to be clear, okay. Pope gave us some money. Um, that's cool. Um, I wonder should we hold another feast? Probably, right? Go use that Pope money. Hold on the feast. Love holding feasts. Should also probably build some new. Um... Oh, construct a new holding. Ooh, I can make new cities. Ooh. Oh. Cool. All right.
All right. Feast. Um, and we are coming up on uh, race five in Los Alamitos. It's great too. Lots of good stuff there. Child but as an adult, it's sufficient, it's sufficient to tool if you a child that just played a little natural inclination for scholarships, such as Stardo. Um, his understanding of philosophical and theoretical work, works is impressive, and he often engages in debate with his former teacher. Okay, that's awesome. So he's. Yeah, he's a mastermind philosopher. Yes, Bastardo. Because this could be real cool. Because we we could move into our next, you know, like our next thing could be, you know, what is yeah, learning, you know, like with with the Stardo. So we'll see. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. I mean, the Stardo is really coming to his own here. So he's brave, temperate, impatient. That's okay. And a mastermind philosopher. I mean, that's really great. I think. And this is going to be our, our air, so we're going to have to figure that out. Oh, Los Alamitos, here we go. Four and five. Five star rock and chatterbox. Oh, nope, this is Remington Park not. Never mind, never mind. Los Alamitos in a bit. Um, that for now. Okay. All right, uh, so yeah, so Bastardo, though, we're gonna, I think we want to make Bastardo our heir, because this is our other heir, Sebastian, and he's lazy, arbitrary, forgiving, elusive shadow, and slow. And so, yeah, um, so we learned earlier we can actually just, like, disinherit, and it costs us some dynasty points. That's not great, but it's doable. You know, or we can murder him. Um, oh no, he's our child. We can't murder him. Um, ask him to take the house. Oh, he's married. Right. And he's the heir to the land of type. Okay. Alright, should have done that earlier. <laughs> a little late for the vows. <laughs> <laughs> he's, got, he's got a kid. <laughs> he's got a wife and a kid. Please take the mouse, please. It's time. It's time. You're, you're 26. Walk away from it all. Alright. Um, let's see. What would life be without Mabel? Oh. Mabel. Oh, my sister. Oh, Mabel. That's my sister. Look at that. Princess of Sicily. Married to Grand Prince of Pinks. 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 Such a joy to see her. What would life be without her? All right, awesome. Yeah, we're catching up with the feast. That's cool. <laughs> Everyone headed for the second homes. Yep, I'm going to thank. Everyone likes us again. Realm. Yeah, we are, I mean, we have some real happy vassals here. <laughs> Vassal happiness, not a problem for us at all. That's really good. And yeah, we probably don't need to continue swaying Count William at this point. What's he at? 89? Yeah, we're, we're good there. Uh, let's see. So we should really take on a different plot. Um, yeah, we can abandon this. And, yeah, I don't know. I think I want to... What can I do? Um, 
What do we want to do for a plot? What can we do with the Pope? I guess that's a good question. Pope man. We could sway him. Yeah, I mean, just plus 11. Oh, Pope is terrified of us. Nice. I war on him, but he's got a lot of... Oh, similar. I guess if we call in all our allies. But we need a lot of piety to declare war on the Pope. It's not practical. Um... Now we can attempt to murder him. Not that that does us a whole lot of good. We attempt to <laughs> abduct him. Oh, there actually is an achievement for getting a hook on the Pope. So, I think it needs to be a strong hook, though. Let's see. What does this do? Scheme is successful. You get a hook on Pope Urbanus. You can keep fabricating hooks at his court. Every month. Yeah, let's try and fabricate a hook on the Pope. Oh, Los Alamitos 5. Let's go. Okay, King Guy. We've been burdened with your oppressive laws for far too long. Oh, this is the peasant, uh, peasant revolt. Um, uh, let's see. No, let's just we'll just put down the peasant revolt. It's not going to be a problem. Problem. Come on, come on, go into the actual place. There we go. Okay, peasant revolt is done. Prison leader Biaju. Great. Oh, my brother Roger died. Hmm. Great. Prisoners. We got this guy. Uh, let's see. Didn't we get a thing that like helps us torture people? Let's see. Lose a seventh of opinion. Well, that's fine. Um. Might discover a secret. Might gain some dark insights. Hmm. Okay. All right, let's, let's give it a shot. Nice, gained some dark insights. What that means. Oh, our Bastardo can marry, that's cool. And then what about this guy? Um, all close family members and spouse of him lose opinion of us. Is that important? Let's see. Hmm. Alright, we'll leave him alone for now.
Torture. Why complicate matters? Is that a good old rack? This how when bones and sinew snap is quite unforgettable. Not as unforgettable as the pain beyond your sinew experience. Okay. It had to be done. Duchess Ileana has announced the world chain of vassals converted to a pistol. Okay, that's fine. As long as infighting still happening. Alright. Four and five. Five star rock. Shatter box. Let's go. Let's help meet us five. That price with Chatterbox. Chatterbox. Five horse. Very nice. We're live into the first leg of the pick four. Okay. Uh, let's see. Christian Pil Pilgrims. Crusader Kings. Wow. Okay. Christian Pilgrims from the Holy Land suffer all manner of abuse. The rats are fraught with danger. Order to protect the Pilgrims and secure Jerusalem for the Christ of His Holiness. Pope Urbanus has accepted the possibility of an outright invasion by joint Christian forces. Oh, we're getting some actual crusades happening here. Huge. Okay, let's check out Bastardo here. So Bastardo, again, Bastardo could end up being very important for us here. Oh, oh! I must have. I think I filtered this earlier. Uh, oh, well, adult. Set to defaults. Empty of Pusa. She's 35, and he's 17, so that's not ideal. Um, all right, I think we leave him unmarried for now. Household soldiers. Nice. Still working on chronicle writing. Nine more years on that. Desecrating the holy grounds of Jerusalem. Holy See promises full absolution from all sins and a guaranteed place in heaven. Huge. Uh, pledge to join the crusade. And yeah, lots of good stuff happening. Um, I will gladly help finance this holy cause. So we we give it some we give it some money and we get a little piety in return, or we don't do anything. Um, no, I think we actually say like, hey, let's yeah, we're 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 in. We can. We're in peacetime here, so I think we I think we're actually well, we kind of are. I mean, that, this whole thing where all all my counties decide to fight each other is not ideal. Okay, my daughter Olympia has fallen ill with pneumonia. Hmm, Olympia. Which one was she again? Um. Uh. Yeah, let's do a safe a safe treatment. 
This is, like, these are troops we could be using to fight a holy war, folks. Like, let's not... Let's consider, uh, doing that instead. Okay, no beneficiary selected for crusade. The great holy wars, each participant may have a beneficiary. The beneficiary will get some of the conquered titles of the war as one. Oh. Um, so yeah, this whole beneficiary thing is confusing. I guess our cousin, yeah, I mean, sure. Um, so this is like, hey, if we end up capturing some titles, uh, then like, our cousins can get them. That's cool. Um, okay, I mean, let's, sure, let's do Flandine. Alright, Flandine. Okay, and so now we're going to, we're going to Holy War. Um, oh, Rosalie can have a guardian. That's cool. Um... Can we get, can we like, what's, what's the likelihood we could have like the Pope be our guardian? Okay, I guess that doesn't happen. Uh, oh, no, it, it might. Uh, let's see. So, like Princess Rosalie. Has a better chance of being, uh, let's see. Limpiu is our grandson or our daughter. Um, yeah, let's do our grandson. That's a good backup plan. So, so if we do our grandson. Wow, this is cool. We can have our grandson have the Pope be his guardian here. That's super cool. Um, yeah, let's let's go. That's great. Um, okay, and then let's see. So then we, yeah, we need to, we will need to participate in this holy war. So let's actually military. Let's go ahead and raise some levies here. Hmm. 
Okay, well, where are we going with these holy wars? What's the what's the target? Well, crusade for the kingdom of Jerusalem. All right, so this guy and his. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look at this. These are all. We need to head down there. Okay. Yeah. Well, we're located pretty close, so that's that's cool. It's unclear, like, I don't see any other troops down here yet, so it's like, should we just go in and, like, have a ball in there? Like, what are we, <laughs> what are we, where are we, where are we grouping up? Where do we find the rest of the Crusaders? Alright, we sent our grandson to be, um... To uh, apprentice with the Pope, our um, daughter recovered from pneumonia. Things are looking up. Oh, why did these all? No, I don't want these all to be in separate places. I want them all to be in the same place. A lot of our armies are being used to fight within our territories here. Not a huge fan of that. Alright. Um, oh no. Trinos died. We need a new marshal. Um... Sure, Count Immel. Wow, he loves us now. All of our vassals really like us. Oh, no, except Duke. Oh, no! Joffrey, what happened? What happened? He could actually be on the council. He's got pretty good traits. Um, well, not as good of traits, though. Oh, hey, we finally have a um, competent bishop. Look at that. Gomez. Love it. That's nice. Um, okay, so we're going. We need to go help with the conquest of the kingdom of Jerusalem. Which I don't really see any other troops helping with yet. So it's. Is this like just gonna be us, you know? Um. Like just, just roll in here and. There, yeah, right there. Just, yep. Just Sail right in there. <laughs> it's one way to fight the Holy Wars. <laughs> I, am I commanding this? No, good, okay, that's good. Hopefully I am home. Yes, I am, okay, good. Because this, <laughs> this may very well end in bloodshed here. Oh, okay, yeah, that's not, but that's not even an enemy, so what, like, like okay, great. We've. I mean, we're here. Anyone else holy wars in here? What like? Any anyone want a holy war right now? Anyone looking to? Anyone interested in 
no holy war. I mean, I guess maybe we go this way. Let's try it. Let's, let's try going over here. It's also not. But it's not it's not this war. Um, nice lobster. I don't know. When we showed up. We're here. We're we're holy warsing. Um Yeah, I mean this is I mean these yes, these people. They're all they're all over here. Oh, guarding for Rosalie. Also the Pope. Just keep keep sending people to the keep sending the Pope. Um yeah, let's have our wife be her guardian. That'll work. I don't know. We went all this way. Wage holy conquest on the on Jerusalem, and there's, there's not there's no one here. No war happening here. We just follow where these other people are going. Oh, fabricated hook, barbaric but effective. The simplest solution is often the best. <laughs> um, a few strong men and ominously worded letters. Wow. We use strong men and ominously worded letters to uh, to get a hook on the Pope. That's pretty good. Um, we get a strong hook on Pope Urbanus. Nice achievement above God. Nice. Told you that was an achievement. And a strong hook on your head of faith. Love it. Love it. Awesome. That's the rarity on that. 0.1%. Woo! Nice. Good rarity on that one. Um, okay. He's only minus one, and he's terrified of us. Yeah, well, because look, I mean, now we can just... It's like whatever we want. Whatever we want from the Pope. We got it. We want to seduce him. You know? No. Okay, that one that one won't work. Uh, but anything else. Whatever else we want. Pope's our man. That's excellent. Okay, I just wish we figured out how to fight this holy war. Oh, we'll sound with a six. Five minutes of post. Alright. What do we got? We got the three and four. Kind of keep wandering around down here until we find something that we can actually attack. I don't quite get it. I mean, it's, let's see. Oh, launch it in seven months. Oh, it's not active yet. <sighs> okay, should we just leave our troops here for seven months? <laughs> leave them, leave them on top of Jerusalem for seven months. Yes. Yep, right there. Right there. Perk. 
I schemed. Ooh, we can have one more hostile scheme. That's nice. That's very helpful. Oh, I guess we can have both a hostile and a personal scheme at once. At once, and now we have two hostile schemes. Huh. Waiting on these crusades to start. Three months. Hey, oh, nope. Nice. Culture in Napoli changed to Sicilian. That's awesome. Okay, I think, well, there's definitely some attacks going on here. Uh, 58 days. Okay. Got it. Okay, crusade for Jerusalem. Here we go. Here we go. Time has finally come. Bring St. George's holy wrath against the vile infidels of Jerusalem. Holy bird gets the win. Oh, yeah. yeah, we're there. We're right on top of it. Uh, inflamed by righteous fury and unyielding resolve, the greater and crusader is assembled by uh, pro Bourbonus, sets forth to deliver divine justice upon the wicked and earned place in heaven. Awesome. So we are we are on it here. Deus Volt! Day is Volt! Okay, all right, we're, wow, lots of lots of enemies here. Fortunately, we have, there's other, we're not the only people here. Um, so, is this, so wait, are we not, why are we not sieging? Oh, no, we'll lose decisively. Okay, let's retreat to the ghost. Retreat to the, oh, we did not retreat to the ghost at the time. Oh, no, oh, no, okay, all right, that's, our army is done. <laughs> oh dear. Um, well, quite the crusade. Um, yes, yeah, so you you can just limp right back home. Oh wow, lots of other troops. Yeah, see, probably should have gone with the with the whole with with <laughs> with this crew here, as opposed to. Um, as opposed to being right on Jerusalem when war broke out. Uh, well, next time. Um, okay. Let's bring this army back home here. Yeah, look at that. 11,000 troops going down. Uh... Yeah, see that that would have been these many this would have been great to land with these troops. Oh look at this. Jerusalem's getting all messed up. My niece, Prince Eric, has been showing signs of pregnancy for some time now, and everyone thought her husband, Count Vilmos, was the father of the child. Now it's become clear the real father is none other than Pau. Oh, the bishop. Only it could have stayed a secret. And she's imprisoned by the king of Hungary. Oh yeah, holy war going great. Uh, what's our what's our contribution here? Mike, we're first. We are we're number one in our contribution. Look at that. We could we could share twenty percent of the war chest if the war were to end today. Um, that's great. Yeah, we we contributed a lot. Um, Okay, so I mean, yeah, we can see if we have more. Like, what's our uh, what's our army situation looking like here? Yeah, we got we were defeated there. Empty council position. Oh, our chancellor. Ah, well, we can finally make Joffrey happy because he will be pretty good at chancelling, reasonable at least. Um, or use dash. Oh, let's Alameda six. Here we go. Three of the four. Oh, let's go, let's go for it. Nope, hold off the five. Oh!
Very close. I think the five. I think the five won it. In which case, the late pick four is dead. Um. Okay. Let's see. So. Yeah. Let's go with Joffrey here. help here like we could take you know if you go this this guy where the guy go this guy like can we murder him yeah that'd help look at that 95% chance huge this is like the guy we're fighting <laughs> let's go yeah all right that'll work where's wife Probably won't get that much done. All right, what about his heir? This is primary heir. And we're him. There we go. Now we're just, see, we got all these, we, we, um, we figured out how to, oh wow, we can invite a lot of people to help us here. Um, This is cool. So we can we can invite people to we can invite people to join our scheme here. So yeah, let's go ahead and bribe her for 70 gold. Get her in on it. Okay. Yeah, so do we have any troops left? 662. That's not really going to get much done. Um, although at this point, I mean, we're just having a ball down here. So I think it's probably worth just like, you know, um, just going for it. Because uh, it can't hurt. Um, all here. Okay, 726, yep. And maybe not us personally. Um, let's have, oh, do we not? Wow, we're really lacking in people that can lead armies here, huh? Um, yeah, the five won it. It's gone official. Close one though. Okay, um, let's see. So, yeah, let's send this guy Beneduto instead. There we go. Because I'm just worried about us going down to. Crusade land with only 700 troops and not coming back. <laughs> um, okay, so let's go. Yeah, let's go join 
you know, siege of Jerusalem or something. Oh, we're resulting 100 casualties right here. Or, you know, here. Hey, see, look, we're, now we're, now we're synced up with, uh, with the real folks. Of course, that loathsome Sultan Zerga would cause problems. She fails to take proper precautions when moving around Sultan Athanasios' court, and the Sultan is starting to notice. It's only a matter of time before she is discovered. Traces of someone sneaking around will surely stress him out. 64% chance of remaining undetected, or she gains slothful agent. Um, yeah, let's try this. Yes, okay. Order scheme gain progress, very good. All right, so our army is, where's our army? Almost there. Look at this, we're contributing, see? We're, we're really, we're key here. We're gonna participate in the siege of something here. Let's go here. So we can't even get to these cities before they're sieged. There we go, see, look at this, look at this. We're sieging Zulgar, huge, huge. Huge contribution from us. What are we? We're first, see? We're still first, somehow. Massive. Massive. All right. Um, see, now we're sieging this. It's huge. Murder en route. When time comes, my agents will need a safe escape. I like how we're also plotting. I mean, we're gonna kill like the main guy behind the, <laughs> the enemy here. Um, so, let's see, um, okay, um, <sighs> my agents need a escape, safe escape route. Okay, detailed map of the desert. Yeah, sure, we could pay for a map. Um, possible outcomes. He brags about his newly acquired wealth. Or we explore the desert ourselves. And... And let's see, 60%. We get lost in the desert. Uh, yeah, sure, let's pay this guy. Okay, uh, what's happening? Uh, oh, we're, yeah, see, we're sieging. Look at this, we're making huge progress here. We're sieging this thing. Uh oh. Uh, how old are we these days? 58. Okay, um. Ah, nice, okay. We are, our physicians are great. Really great. Okay, let's keep sieging this city. Man, there's a lot happening down here. It's a big old war. Murder! Secret tunnel. My agent Miriam approached me with a bunch of papers clutched in her hands. I found old architectural papers from the Unlanded's castle. Oh, this is for the prince. Oh, the prince's castle. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, this looks like a tunnel we can use. Excellent. Um, yes. Murder scheme gains progress. Excellent. Uh, great, I'm well again. One of my agents has acquired a deadly spider and arranged for a servant to hide it in Sultan Athanasios' bed before dark. This is getting good. Um, all they need to do is my go ahead and he'll be as good as dead the moment the spider strikes. Yes. Hope you're not afraid of spiders, Athanasios. <laughs> yes. 95% chance of killing him. And then we've got the, oh no, some, uh, someone discovered our plot to kill his son though. Um, uh -oh. Ah, we killed him. We killed him. Wow. <laughs> By the lethal bite of a deadly spider. Wow. 
Thankfully, spiders do not talk, so the attack cannot be traced back to me. My little friend has done its work well. Wow, so we killed the opposition, the opposing crusade dude. Uh, oh no, our duke has been excommunicated by the Pope. That's not great. Um, uh, wow. So we just, we just took... We just killed the main dude that we are crusading against with a poisonous spider. That's very cool. Very, very cool. Um, let's see. Let's, should we try and... Well, that's already taken. Uh, Victorious Crusade! <laughs> I feel like we had a big hand in this. Uh, St. George has granted Queen Flandine victory in the crusade for Jerusalem. After defeating Sultan Mikhail and his heathen warriors on several occasions, our warriors forced the enemies of the faith to admit their ignominious defeat. With the occupied lands firmly under the leadership of the pious Catholic ruler, we can rest assured the divine will of St. George has been enacted. It's a glorious day for all the true followers of the cross. St. George is with us. Wow, we won the war. And I mean, we, had, we played, despite our meager army size, we played a big role in that. Um, oh, wow. And Flandine is now the Queen of Jerusalem. The person that we nominated to be, like, the beneficiary. Crazy. Um, oh, here we go. So, Flandine got the Kingdom of Jerusalem. Okay. <laughs> Wish we could have nominated ourselves. Um, all titles nominated a bunch. Uh, wow! We earned 1,100 gold. Oh my god. 595 piety. 1,100 gold. 2,400 prestige. That's huge! And then we were, and we were rank one. Wow. Well, we did, we did, we did manage to murder the, uh, opposing sultan. Um, wow. That's amazing. Oh, hey, we got an achievement too. Took part in took part in the Holy War, I think. Um, and there it is for the faith. For the faith. Take part in successful Great Holy War on either side. Okay. Sheikh Majid is preparing a special trip for young Sultan Mikhail. Well, we've already won the war. Uh, the child trusts he will be brought out on a durable day in the forest. So the problem is, well, the existence is known to the target. Okay, he will get lost in the forest. The child lost in the forest happens tragically often. 89% chance of success. Um, yeah, let's go. Uh, okay, with the establishment of the proper Catholic queen in Jerusalem, the faithful can finally rest easy knowing that St. George is smiling upon our good works. The fact that the new rule of Jerusalem belongs to my dynasty is only further proof of our divine favor. Excellent. Oh, we can play as her. <gasps> wow. That's cool. Just swap over to be the new queen of Jerusalem? Huh. Okay. Um, it's a big decision, though.
All right. Um. Hmm. Well, let's take a look at this King of Jerusalem. Whoa. Ooh, that's huge. I mean, that's much bigger than we have. Um. She's a Crusader Queen. Oh, look at this. Wow, look at these traits. Oh my God, she's. See, we picked. Okay, I didn't realize how impactful that was gonna be. I mean, we picked an awesome uh, beneficiary. I didn't realize it was even that important. Good thing we, we picked someone good. Um, oh wow, our errors count Eustace, Eustache. Uh, that's awesome, so. Um, that's so cool. Yeah, she's a badass. Uh, Mastermind Philosopher, Crusader Queen. That's fantastic. Okay, yeah, I think let's actually switch to her. Wow. Okay, so we are now... We are now playing as the Queen of Jerusalem. That's insane! Wow! What a game! Oh, but what about all the... <laughs> I would have liked to get all the money that I won, though. That went back to... It's back in Sicily with my old... Uh, my old dude here, King Guy, wealthy over there. Um, too far away to interact with. Oh, used to be him. Now I can't even interact with him. Wow, that's crazy. That it can change that dramatically, or that you can just pivot like that. Yeah. Um, okay, let's see. So. Uh, okay. Advice protecting against schemes. Many dangers lurk in the shadows, and the threat of schemes is never far away. Yeah, totally. Um. Spy master with very low opinion of you can be a death sentence. Yeah, okay. Um. Ooh. Wow, look at all these alliances, too. Oh, no, these are truces, not alliances. Lots of truces with all the people that we just fought with for a while. Okay, um, let's see, so what's our, what does our realm look like here? Okay. And our, we definitely are going to need a physician. Council, we're going to appoint all the councils here. So we got our husband here, and he is... He's good at learning, so we will have him assist our archbishop, which, yeah, we are actually, yeah, we're going to need, we're going to need a lot of archbishoping right now. Uh, we got a whole lot of people to convert. Whole lot of people to convert. Big, big old challenge. <laughs> they said it couldn't be done. Uh... <laughs> Uh, okay, so yes, yeah, so we're gonna have him focus on patronage, and we're gonna just get to work here. Yep, just all that. Let's start with Jerusalem. We would like to make that a fully Catholic uh, zone. <laughs> the stream gets <laughs> extremely politically incorrect. Uh, so, yep, just get to work on converting Jerusalem to Catholicism, please. Um, let's see. Uh, Chancellor. Count Vitali of Jaffa. Yeah, that would be good. He's a powerful guy. Eleven... 
Yeah, I like it. Okay. Steward. Who's our best steward dude here? Mayor, bishop, uh, countess. She's powerful. Uh, 11, 11, 8. Okay, this guy's definitely better. Um, uh, okay, let's, let's, let's put her there. She's a, yeah, she's a poor steward, so that's not going to be great, but figure it out. Um, a key, Marshall. Marshall. Oh, wow. Jordan to Hotville. It's fantastic. Um, I think we appoint him marshal. We're going to need help here with increasing control for sure. So, um, oh, oh, interesting. It's already at 100% control. Huh. Uh, okay, we actually only have one, only one county with control issues? Oh, I guess because our vassals are actually pretty loyal because they all came with us. Is that, is it just the local population that's the problem? Uh, I don't know. Okay, uh, let's see. Spymaster, Countess Sophia. Yeah, she's fantastic. 20. Wow. Well, that's going to help a lot. We're going to need her. Um, so we're going to need her to uh, disrupt schemes for sure. Yep. And she likes us now, so that's good. We should get our... Uh, Archbishop on our good side here, so let's try and sway him. Yep, and um, okay, and then we need to pick a lifestyle. So she's super learning y, so we're gonna, so if you're learning education, you need 40% more experience. Wow, that's huge! That's huge. She's already got whole of body. She's got this whole tree already. Um, and let's see. So learning plus one, health small boost, learning experience, learning plus three, development growth, learning plus one, piety plus one. I think I'm gonna go scholarship focus, development growth. We got a whole we got a whole nation to develop here. A kingdom to develop here. Okay, uh, let's see. What else is going here? Realm will lose land when vassals die. Okay, we we'll need to fix that. You can lawfully imprison Bishop Elizabeta. Um Well not sixty. Oh, well Salamito seven. Okay, we are looking for be one horse here. Reason to stay in. Oh, not even close. Reason to stay in. Let's go. Let's go. Just, yep. Just kick at the end there. Little kick, little kick, little kick, little kick. Keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it. All right, no problem. All right, we got the one across the line. We're in for the daily double. We're looking for the four or six horse in the eighth race, and that'll close out the night. 
Okay, a um, few knights. We should recruit some knights. Oh boy, lots of lots of new options here. Found a holy order. Hmm, cool. Embrace celibacy. Um, invite knights. Send the herald. Okay. Okay, powerful vassals expect council positions. Well, he likes us anyway, so I'm okay with that. What's going on with his wife? This figure. Hmm. Okay. And this guy. Yeah, he actually he doesn't, doesn't dislike us that much. Um, he's not very powerful either, so. Okay, and then what we want is we want to double check. So, okay, so this, we're going to lose this, probably, I guess, because of our succession laws. Um, so his heir is his wife. Or no, someone else. He also has a weird mask. His heir is, yeah, because, well, okay, so, but if they have a kid, then this will. This will resolve, but he's ill. Okay, this we should actually probably fi fix this situation pretty quickly. Um. Okay, and then what's this? So Dor Dorothea. Yeah. Also, she needs to have a kid. Because her current heir is her father. <laughs> uh. Yeah. Okay. Negev. Hmm. Okay, so we should probably uh, we should probably do some things here. Um, Let's see if there's uh, succession. See, changing this succession, I think, will actually not help. Um, uh, yeah, this actually won't help, I think, because the problem is that these people don't have kids, and so it's just going to some other random person who's not my vassal, I think. Wow, oh, we're bringing the Sicilian culture down here too. Is that really my culture? The Sicilian? Sicilian, yep. Oh yeah, we're so close to chronicle writing. Been working on that for a while. Her stress level is pretty high. 50, yeah, oh, okay, actually not too bad. 50, 300, but yeah, we should probably hold a feast. Now that we've won the war. It's feast time. Most feast, that'll help all our vassals like us more anyway. And a lower stress. Be good for everyone, really. It's got to slow time down a little bit. Yes, they're gathered and get gathered in the great hall. The mood is bright. Peace begins. Welcome, friends. Mm. Court physician. Okay, so oh wow, he's um we have an additional option because of our learning skill. Uh, I guess what do we get him cheaper or what? Oh no, it's a different guy. Abdul Wahad. Abdul Wahad, who's 15. There's Abdul Razak, who's 21. Okay, wait, but this other guy's better. Um, so why would I do the one? So he, 
this guy's a scholar and a mastermind philosopher. This guy is a, oh, but this guy, right, this guy's a physician, an actual physician, I guess. Two-star physician. Yeah, so I think it's like you want you want an actual physician, I'm guessing. Herbalist. Alright. Let's let's get him. I did everything I could, ensuring Mayor Andarn and Raoul would be far from each other as possible. It was not enough. They now have come blows in the middle of my feast. Oh wow. Um let's see. Raul is my archbishop. I don't really want to. I don't want to offend him. Um, but Adarn is a mayor of mine. I don't want to throw. I don't want to. I don't want to get either of these people's bad sides. Hmm. All right. Well, let's do Raul. Like, like, it's like we win the Crusades, we become Queen of Jerusalem, and the Archbishop that the, that the point that the Pope sends us has average learning. It's like it's like your most important task right now is is dealing with this new Kingdom of Jerusalem, and you send an average bishop. Uh, okay. Rabid Archbishop is sensitive to almond. It's something I sadly forgot to tell the cook. Uh, oh wow, we can <laughs> uh, we can not tell him about the almonds, and he will get he will become in very bad health for seven years. Hmm. Or um, we can save him, get a hook on him. That seems better making a rival out of our bishop. With everyone headed for their respective homes, I'm proud to say the feast was a success. Until next time, every guest gains 20 opinions, so that actually should put us in the green with... Oh, no, puts us exactly at zero with Raul. Okay, and then other folks it should do pretty well. What about our realm in general? We are looking pretty good with all of our vassals here. Yeah. It's awesome. Looking really good. Okay. This is our successor, Count Eustache. Um, how is he doing? He's He has lover's pox. Not great. And... My nephew, okay. Hmm. We're 56, so we're probably not, probably not gonna be having more kids here. This is the tricky thing about playing as a woman ruler here, is it is hard to generate new kids past a certain point. Um, so I guess we just have to deal with his nephew or, let's see, what would, does it tell us who, his son, what's up with his son, charming and shy, hmm, I think we should try and stay alive as long as possible, <laughs> uh, you know what, actually, let's do this, let's see if he will let us be the, Oh, he's too far away to interact with. Oh, that sucks. 
Uh, I was hoping to see if I could be like the ward of his son. But he's too far away. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, we have a faction against us here. It's just this one dude. And I think he's going to come around to us, so. I'm not super concerned. Yep, they disbanded. Nice. Brother Jordan died. This guy is physician, actually. He is better than our current physician. Um, how do we do that? I guess we can't. Our physician doesn't like us very much. Short rain. Catholicism is evil. Okay. Uh, just, oh, we can just fire him. Yeah, okay. Well, what, did this other guy like us? Yeah, he does. Okay, so I think let's actually... Yeah, which we just, we just brought him in, but, you know. Uh, okay, fire him. Yep, good. And this other guy... Recruit to court... Yes. And then appoint his court physician. Yes. Okay. Great. More qualified anyway. He likes us more. All good things for a physician. Oh, let's make sure our council are all doing uh, useful things. So let's make sure we have a marshal. Oh, wow. This guy's badass. Okay. Our bishop is trying to convert people. Our chancellor is dealing with... We should really deal with domestic affairs. Our steward is collecting taxes. Let's actually promote culture instead. Got a lot of culture to promote here. And our marshal is resting control of Gaza. And our spy master is disrupting schemes. Okay, that all seems good. Valdrada has been showing the signs of pregnancy for some time now. Everyone thought her husband Bertalan was the father of the child. Now it's become clear the real father to be is none other than Abdul Wahad. That's our former um, court physician. <laughs> Scandal indeed. Now everyone knows.
sway him. Still have this problem with the losing land thing. Is this guy still ill? He is. Oh, he's no longer ill. Great. Um, that's helpful. Okay, good. Um, so we could revoke his title, right? Um, but we don't have a reason to. Um, right, we don't have a reason to because it, so it would be tyranny, which is going to be very unfortunate. Um, okay. Uh, this countess. Both of them like us a lot. Yeah, we don't have reasons to do either of these things. Um, now we could, um, oh right, we lost all of our intrigue skills. Uh, right, so we actually don't have the ability to do things like that anymore, because yeah, we could have, um, we could have done like, uh, uh, you know, um, oh, retract Basil, what's that? Make one of him, oh. Um, yeah, we could have fabricated, like, some issue with him and used that as cause to, uh, take back his thing. Okay, so, let's see. This is an act of tyranny. Hmm. Okay, well, let's not do that right now, then. Oh, faction. A lot of folks involved there. We got a peasant rebellion happening real soon here. But that's okay. We got holy warriors and all sorts of folks. So death to his part. Husband, as you drew your last breath, relief washed over me. Perhaps I should be ashamed, but in truth, there was no love loss between us. Finally, I am free to start my life anew. <laughs> all right, our husband has died. That's fine. Um, yeah, that's totally fine. See, we could get married. Uh, if you're no heir of your dynasty, the game will end. Yeah, but we're not gonna have any more children anyway, so it really just more be if there's something that gets us an alliance. Oh, marry my old character. Ah, oh, that's a good idea, although I think he might be too far away to interact with. Um, that is a good idea, though. Also, he does have a wife. Uh, a lot of kids. Um, yeah, too far away to interact with. Hmm. But yeah, that's an awesome idea. Um... And yeah, marry him in like matrilinearly, uh, matrilineally, so that uh, so that I get uh, all his uh, stuff when he dies instead of his kids. Um, what's up with uh, drunkard, hunchback? Wow. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I think he's just too far away to interact with. So is the Pope also too far away to interact with? Or I guess because he, he's our head of religion, so I guess he can. Um, uh, I guess we can talk to him from wherever. So, all right, it's fine. Um, still, few knights. We could use more knights, huh? 
do that again? No, we gotta wait. Brace celibacy. Clergy opinion plus ten. I mean, we're given we're not gonna get not gonna show it anyway. Um, that will help us with uh, multiple relationships here. So let's actually go ahead and do that. Um, Pilgrimage. For 15 years. Oh, no, it'll be unavailable for 15 years. Okay, that sounds cool. I mean, we have a holy site, like, right here. Yeah, so let's... <laughs> let's go to, uh... Oh, I wonder if we, like... So, could we, like, sail over here and get married? And... I like a yeah, pilgrimage to Jerusalem, which is like our capital. Just walk down the street, a little pilgrimage real quick. Uh, let's go, okay, so let's go to the Vatican and let's see what happens when, because I believe our character will physically go to you know, we're gonna, I think, physically go to the Vatican. I like the, I like the, uh, the pilgrimage music. Uh, where does it say? Somewhere here it says, located in Vaticano. Okay, so we are, we're now in the Vatican. And does that mean that now these folks are, like, interactable? No, they're still too far away. Uh, okay, so it must be from your capital, not from where your character is currently. Super pious. Oh, yeah. Awesome companions. For every week that passes, my fellowship grows even smaller. Some people have gone as far as they can before they need to return home. The most worrying is the fact that my group of personal guards is thinning out at an alarming rate. Oh, no. Um, yeah. Uh, Now let's yeah, let's get the protection of God here. If she gets murdered while she is visiting the Vatican, this will work out very poorly. But. As I'm getting closer to Vaticano, I meet more and more fellow pilgrims from all manner of places. It is one of these pilgrims who recognize me from afar. Queen Flandine, is that you? It is none other than my vassal, Mayor Adarn. We have been brought together by God. He becomes a friend. An auspicious meeting, but I must pray in solitude. No, let's, yeah. Nice. Yeah, everyone really likes us. All our subjects. Oh, cool. Increased control in county. Okay. Let's see. Are there still areas that need... Control here, yeah, 75, 100, 100, 100. Okay, yeah, so Jaffa. Let's put him over there. Yeah, great. Okay. I'm finally here, body and soul, at the great church of Vaticano. As the bishop offers me blessings, I reflect on everything that happened, had to happen for God to bring me here this moment in time. Oh, wow, 625 piety. That's a ton. Pilgrim, same faith opinion, plus five. Very nice. Um, armed pilgrimages, we det gained determined pilgrim. Nice, that's fantastic. 
And now, real quick, that was... Uh, just double-checking again that I can't... That, that, now that I'm officially in Vaticano. No. Still too far away to interact with. Huh. I mean, I wonder if I, like, led a fleet and... You know, because, like, I was able to scheme to kill the Sultan and stuff down here, you know, even though I wasn't... You know, that wasn't that near my kingdom, but... journey's been a long one, but I've finally come home again. Much, while much remains the same, something has changed in how the priests and bishops treat me. Um, yeah, nice. Okay. So, yeah, I think, like, our bishop must love us now. Yeah, that's awesome. And, yeah, I think just generally, folks are really digging us. So, that's awesome. We're 57, so we're getting up there. Um... So I'm going to say, last race of the night, we need the four or the six. Or no, we need the, yeah, we need the four or the six. Make it a triple or Sokudo. Sokudo looking good. Sokudo looking great. Just pulling away there. Let's go, Sokudo. Keep it up. Where's that four? Where's that four? Oh, four is surging. Sokudo finds another gear. I like to hear that. Keep it up, Sokudo. Keep it going. Hold off that five. Hold him off. Hold him off. Hold him off. Hold him off. All the way in. Beautiful. We hit the late daily double. We hit the late daily double. Oh, what a day. What a day. We hit a pick four. We hit... We... We... Made, made out big on the derby and we hit the late daily double at Los Alamitos with a nice price 3 to 1 on Sokudo see how that pays out wow what a day what a day alright um let's see so request yeah so this was this is my other thought here, was that, so I get a, if I can get a claim on his duchy, then I have a reason for revoking it, because I have a claim on it. Um, and I mean, I have no shortage of piety. Uh, oh, the Pope will not accept it, though. Okay. Um, okay, what if I fabricate a claim? Fabricate a claim on um, on the, what is it, the Duchy of Urdun. I guess I can only do a county. Yeah, it's a side effect of possibly having a claim on a duchy, but. Okay, but then what about the county of Tiberius? County of Tiberius. St. George Bishop, your court chaplain's current task convert faith in county of Oh, right, yeah. Okay, no. Um, I mean, it's it's a tall order. He's gonna, it's going to take him 18 years to convert Jerusalem to Catholicism. So let's 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 maybe give a more realistic goal.
appreciate his, I appreciate him planning for the long term there. in faith. In the county of Jaffa, they believe in Ismailism, and they do not pray to God. Um, how they worship is none of my business. He gains religious understanding, or the county gains religious understanding, and he loses five opinion of us. Well, we can lose, we can, yeah, we can, we can spare that. Fighting happening here. Oh, different culture pin plus 15. That'll be useful. Unlock that. Uh, I've been studying the ancient religious texts. By my calculation... Oh, the world will end 6,000 years after its creation. By my calculations, we're less than a century away. My Archbishop Raoul urges me to keep it to myself. Leave it to the clergy to and avoid panic. What if your calculations are wrong? Everyone deserves to learn the truth. Woo, the daily double paid well. One dollar daily double. Pay nine ten. Nice. Nice. may lead down a path of zealousness. Well, that could be okay. Versus cynicism. Um, let's consult with more priests. Man, lots of infighting happening right now. Nice. Persuade Raul. Oh, wow. He loves us now. We should spend our time on someone else. Everyone loves us. No one left to sway. Um, I don't know. Uh, everyone, everyone loves us. Uh, I mean, Pope, maybe with Pope. I mean, I think Pope already. Pope probably likes us pretty well too. I guess. Plus 50. That's pretty good. Declare war on him. 
Um, yeah, let's ask him for some gold. Oh, wow, 185. That's nice. Okay, and then let's sway him. Sway him. There we go. Bishop Urbanus II has passed away. You no longer sway him. Oh no, the Pope died. No. No. Okay. Pope Alexander III is who we're dealing with now. Um, immediately attempt to murder him. Uh, let's see. Um, hmm. All right. Well, uh, let's see. So, yeah, it sucks that our errors and stuff are too far away to communicate with. Um, is that, so is the, does that change our bishop at all? No, bishop stays the same. Okay. All right. Man, everyone loves us. Oh, what's up? Except this dangerous fact. Oh, well, the peasants don't like us. All right. Not everyone loves us. Everyone else really loves us, though. Everyone but the peasants. Okay. We will not stand for your vile oppression of good Mashriki's mills any longer. Um, yes. So... Can adopt their culture. I'm not going to do that. Um, I could give all my land to him. I'm not going to do that either. And I can fight them, which I will do. Uh, rally the troops. Okay. Got plenty of. Oh, Burt County. Yeah, yeah, I have, I have been planning to convert. I just want to fa finish fabricating this claim first before I attempt to convert for trailers to them again. Okay, uh, let's see. So let's go ahead and raise all of our armies there. Oh, we got, we got quite a few armies here. Um, and now let's just, uh, let's actually split them into two. If we can. Great. Okay. First army of Jerusalem. You are going to go over here. And this, you are all going to go over here. Peasants not very good at fighting, as it turns out. Poorly. Let's hope our reinforcements get there in time. They did, I think. Oh, darn, if you were still with me. Okay, we lost our mayor. Oh, he's our friend, too. It's mm. uh, fine. Hey. All right. Uh, oh, finally, we have a claim on... Ooh. We can claim the whole duchy. That's fantastic. That's excellent. Um, yeah, that's what we want. Okay, this guy um, is the guy we just... Yep, and... Well, yep, torture him. Yep. Uh, disband our armies. Uh, and now we can assign our archbishop to 
attempt to convert Jerusalem again. Okay. Okay, so we lost a mayor in the process, but uh, fine otherwise. Okay, um, and okay, so now we can actually fix this by revoking his title because we now have a claim to it, I believe. Um. Oh, whoops, not the... What are more holdings of that you're occupied? Oh. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, so it's really the... I mean, it's the duchy we want to revoke, but... Uh, I guess it's currently got some issues going on here. Oh, great. Increase the control there. Wow, awesome. We're actually, like, done with, uh, done with increasing control everywhere. We have control over everything, so. All right, we gotta let this war, I guess, finish over here before we can deal with this situation. Isn't she the other one? Oh, no, it's Countess Jerusalem. Okay. Well, still, I really would like to consolidate more titles under myself directly. Um, she's not my direct vassal. Okay, that's because she is Count Vitale's. Yeah, so what we actually want to do with him is... Oh, demand that he abandons the vassal war. That could be nice. Uh, loses 10 opinion of us. It's fine. Yeah, let's, let's demand that they stop this war. That would be great. Oh, wow. He defied us. Yikes. Okay. Oh, sister died. More populace against us it is what it is. Um, oh, title. Yes, we can. Huh. Um, Lost my court position. Ooh. One legged bubonic plague. Court position's not doing so hot. Oh no, bubonic plague outbreak. That's not great. Um, let's see. Well, let's search for another physician, shall we? Okay, uh, Eusebia. Ooh, 26. Very good. 
two star physician and a three star miracle worker fantastic oh three star physician Six, uh, yeah, 65 years old versus 66 years old. They're both old. Um, okay, I think we'll probably go with her. Jerusalem main mismanaged population. Not great. Okay, bubonic plague keeps happening here. Maria Akos. Oof, very plagued right there. Um Yeah, let's send her away from our court. Oh, all her close family members of opinion. Well that's not great. All right, never mind. This plague outbreak is rough. Plague, a new day. The outbreak of plague, which has ravaged my court, is finally over. Okay, very good. Whew. Tyranny. I don't want these. I want your duchy. They can hold only titles with no land. Take his vassals, though. Or we, oh, this is granting vassals. No, no, that's not what I do. Take his vassals. Mm -hmm. Ransom her to ourselves. <laughs> I think we did. <laughs> Spy master comes with grave news, but we don't know yet. Someone is plotting to kill my guest, Jenna. All right. Well, whatever.
Oh, we finally discovered Chronicle writing. That's been a long, long time coming. Wow. Huge. niece again. Oh, they do have children. She has children now. But why is her heir still her father if she has children? I don't know. Plan of succession. Oh, yeah. Count Georgios. Uh, partition male preference. Count Georgios. Oh, yeah, that's my husband. Great, okay. So actually hers was resolved. And it's just this guy who's not having any kids here. Um, yeah, I mean, maybe we want to plot to kill his wife. Uh, let's see. Or actually, can we just arrange a new marriage for him? Oh no, that's arranging a marriage for someone his and his thing. Um, can't revoke his title. Yeah, that's tricky. It's very tricky. Um, the man surrender and vassal war. Well, at least that would increase the. Uh, or that would decrease the amount of titles that he's dealing with. Um, oh, no, peasant uprising. He's not going to give the peasants. <laughs> I demand that you give your titles over to the peasants. Um, okay, so what we actually want... Oh, cool. Okay, we had some folks join our scheme. That's nice. Um, and then let's see if we can get anyone else in on this. Um, oh, yeah. That'd be great. Bribe? Well, that's expensive. But still, that'll that'll be like night and day if we get here, here in on the scheme. There we go. Now it's 95%. Nice. Um. Go for it. Hope for more gold. Yeah, definitely. Get that murder money. Okay. Um, holy letter. Recent endeavors of realm. Great appreciation of God represented on Earth. Draft a letter to the King Bishop Alexander. Oh, to the Pope. Okay. What does the Pope like? Pope likes... Justice, generosity, stubbornness, thinking. Um, content, content paragon. Just stubborn, generous. I'm gonna say I'm thinking kind of heart because he's generous. Oh, he's impressed. Nice.
properties necessary for departure from the world interrupted by a page. The poor woman died without any help from me. Wow, she just died on her own. Died from complications related to obesity. <laughs> okay, well, that worked out in any case. Okay, what is that? This is more of the pop. Yes, this is gonna be another popular uprising. It's fine, I can deal with it. Oh wow, he already has a new wife? That was quick. Um, she's 18. Perfect. Perfect. Get to work, folks. Get to work. Um, yeah. I need you to have a direct air real soon here. Yeah, see, that's the problem. His, his right, his, his air is like a vassal to the Pope. Which I wonder if we could request the Pope. No. Uh, okay. <coughs> uh, okay, so this is another uh, war on our hands here. Peasants. That's cool. Shouldn't be too much of a problem. Half. Have one of them go here. And the other one go here. Or I could imprison her. Hmm. Oh, I could probably revoke a title, actually. Great. Look into that. What a scandal! Uh, okay, can we revoke her title? Yes, we can. Um, she's a known criminal, so we can actually do this just fine. Great. Revoked. Love it. Um, oh, nice. Our uh, court physician is now a renowned physician. Very nice. Peasant War. Need a new steward. Uh, yep, looks great. Okay, and then we can disband our troops. This guy, yep, and we torture him. Uh, and get spouses out there. Uh, low counter control and negative. Oh, okay. 
Okay, we can fix that. Absolutely fix that. Um, we should host another feast. And we, should, we still gotta deal with this guy, but he, again, he's hopefully, hopefully they're getting on here, but we'll see. Okay, all right, let's hold a feast. We'll do one more feast, and then I'm gonna probably go to sleep. So let's do one more big old feast here. Let's go. Um, yeah, we got this guy. Welcome to the feast, everybody. Uh, witness vassal, Mayor Judita. Sure, friendship could be good. Fine. Sometimes do need to. No problem at all. Uh, this kind of attention local commerce moving to Rome. Capital of King Bishop of Pepsi. Locals in the settle are not praising me. She can surely do no homage perception to me. Uh, yes, take this gold. Oh, we did not sway the Pope. Okay, everyone should really love us after that feast. Ooh, we found a holy order. Oh, because the Pope has high opinion of us now. Nice. And. City of Shabak, City of Baidapeta, City of. Yeah, I think City of Al Rabla. Yeah, let's found a holy order. Ooh, the Knights Hospitaller! Nice. It's only 11 p.m. Yeah, I know, but I stayed up really late last night. Um, okay, we have a holy order now, which I think means I think that shows up. Does that show up here or somewhere? I don't know, but we did. Oh yeah, we got a got a nice achievement for that. Real good achievements popping here.
The sub tab there, top right of that window. Sub tab there, top right of that window. Oh, the holy orders. Oh yeah, there they are. Nice. Okay. Um, I was busy uh, looking at um, uh, looking at how much. Uh, how valuable this achievement was on true steam achievements. Above God, having a strong hook on your head of faith. Above God. Wow, 15.55 ratio. Woo! Two track gamers have unlocked that. Not bad. Not bad. That's the third person to get that achievement. Okay, holy order hired. Holy orders too. Oh yeah, nice. Okay, Knights Templar not available right now, but the Knights Hospitaller, Hospitale, Hospitalia are available. They're very nice. No cost to hire them. You gotta be at war with the Hostile Faith, but whatever. That's cool. All right, nice. Yeah, we, we rocked that. All right, um, and we're still. This guy remains a problem. We're just waiting for his wife to get pregnant here. Um, can do whatever it wants. Oh, another faction created against me. That's this thing where the, um, the peasants revolt again, isn't it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, new learning perk. Love it. Learn on the job. 20% of counselor's primary skills added to your own. That's awesome. Wow, really good perks here. Ooh! Oh, the knights were hired by Norway. So do I get, do I get a cut of that? I think I do. orders. I think I get a, yeah, I think when, let's see. Uh, holy orders, independent military organizations. Rules of the faith might hire the fair at war. It's the war ends in order for the ruler may have a patron. Holy orders, patrons, king or emperor, shares their faith in his realm, contains their capital. The patron may call upon support of the holy order against religious enemies for free instead of paying piety. Not all holy orders have a patron. Oh, okay. All right. So never mind. It's just that I don't have to pay for them. All right. It'd be nice if I got a cut of their uh, of, of their fees, but alas. Um, man, my 
my vassals really like me. Um, King Guy died. Our old... Our old self. Uh, so King Guy died, what, of heart failure at age 65. And you, Stash, took over. Um, who is also our heir. So actually, if we were to die right now, uh, then we would actually have both. Um... Actually, just in general, I think we'll end up having both. Because um, we're not having any new kids, so... Now, he's not the best. He's um, drunkard, lover's pox, uh, builder, generous, compassion. And he's not the worst, either. Uh, not amazing staff, but fine. Uh, oh, but he is... He is not a king. Oh, no. He is not a king. King Olympio is the king. Um, wow, so there's now a new king of Sicily. Olympia. Oh, this is Sebastian's son. Oh, wow. Remember Sebastian. Sebastian was slain in battle at age 36. Wow. And Sebastian's son is now... Wow. Our legacy lives on over there. Okay. So yeah, but this is, yeah, Eustache is our heir. Heir to a lot of things. And so yeah, if we were to die, we would then have, this guy, Eustache, would then have Jerusalem plus that other stuff. I, yeah, I mean, he's... <laughs> I don't know that he'd be able to effectively uh, uh, rule that. But he can certainly try. Still worried about this guy and his wife, who has not yet gotten pregnant. Um, oh. Sophia doesn't like my chancellor. Mm, well, he's, I mean, yeah, he's not great, but he's average. Okay, we need to, we, we're gonna, oh right, no, we're female. I was gonna say, we need to seduce this woman. Um, that would be one tactic, would be to just directly get her pregnant and then pretend it's their kid and they have an heir. Um, all right, I guess we'll play the waiting game. Invoke his titles, no, can't, all right, keep going. Good. Oh boy. Counter, you're gonna need some control help. Olympio is now our dynasty head. Hmm. Oh, wow. We converted Jerusalem to Sicilian culture. Interesting. Um, wow. Okay, what else can we convert? Let's convert Jaffa to Sicilian culture. Why not? You 
to... I struggle to make out the tiny letters in the scroll before me. I feel a headache building once again. Why do scribes insist on writing such small symbols? I squint and try again. Nothing short of a miracle. With the aid of a stone of glass, even old women struggling with bad eyesight could read with ease. Uh, let's see. So we either ask Roll for assistance. No, we do not want him to have a hook on us. Uh, pay 80 gold for a reading stone. Or sell all of our books. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's pay 80 gold for a reading stone. Lead to gold. The transmutation of lead to gold has long been the dream of alchemists around the world. Though many have attempted such feat, nobody is known to have succeeded. Despite this, I have come across some notes written in the Martyrs and Book about plants. They claim that one can create golden rain by boiling, by boiling lead sugar in a filtered solution of seaweed ash. Could such a thing be possible? Yes, let's investigate this golden rain concept. Uh, First reagent I need to obtain is lead sugar, an ingredient used to sweeten wines. I could find a supplier to import what I need, though it would be expensive. Alternatively, I can cheaply manufacture my own by burning metallic lead and dissolving the ashes in vinegar. Um, I don't think I want to do that. Uh, oh, zero percent. Oh, because we're super good. We have actually a zero percent chance of failing to make our own lead sugar. Um, that's great. Okay, cool. Let's make our own lead sugar. Real good at it. Second region I need to obtain is seaweed, a lot of seaweed, 100 drams, shredded and then dried. Where can I get such a substantial amount? I will import it from the coastal towns, demand a seaweed tax from my subjects. This is a sign we're getting old. We're, we're uh, doing a uh, seaweed tax. I can just use my lead to sweeten wines instead. No, no, let's not do that. Let's not do that at all. Let's import the seaweed. Um, aha, we got a perk here. Use the buy claim interaction. Oh, buy claim. Wow. At last, I have all the necessary regions to produce the golden rain. The lead sugar is safely stored in waterproof casks. The cords of dried seaweed are stacked in the furnace ready to burn. Will this be my magnum opus? Begin the experiment. In a few days, I managed to create golden rain. Wealth and glory are mine. Formula does not work, but what did I create instead? What am I doing? This is stupid. Um, no, let's begin the experiment. Uh, upon mixing the lead sugar into the boiled seaweed as ash, the mixture suddenly turned a vibrant yellow. While I did not manage to produce actual gold, I did find that my solution can be used as a dye, which rivals saffron in brilliance. Selling this dye will allow me to recoup some of my costs. Pretty, if uneconomical to produce. <laughs> Alright, we gain an unlock and 40 gold. Yeah, we're, we're working through them here, so we finally can unlock Scholar, which is another plus five learning. I mean, we're just insane on the learning front. Super smart. Um, yeah, what are we at now? 23. 23. Wow. And just a bunch of Scholar, Pilgrim, Celibate, Crusader Queen, Hold of Body. That whole body's gonna be nice. Let's see how long we can hold out here. 64. Still got, still got potential. Um, okay, I continue to be worried about this couple here. Um, Oh, hey, she's pregnant. Finally. Finally. Ah. Oh, hell yes. All right. Finally. Still having problems swaying Pope Alexander. All right. Um, I think they could probably actually have either a boy or girl, and it wouldn't matter, but... 
boy is probably a little safer. Hey, there we go. They have a daughter. Okay, well, still, hopefully. Is that now his heir? It is. Yes. Yes. Fixed. Okay, got it. So he now has an heir. That is a real heir. That's great. Now that warning should go away. Yep, we have no warnings anymore. Okay. Ooh, let's get a lot of gold from our, from our Pope. Yep. Um, yeah, and we're, and we're rolling. That's perfect. Finally. Finally. Um. Um, yeah, what was, yeah. Ansia. Ansia Landolfiri. There she is. Just gotta hope she survives. I don't want to murder her. Oh, let's offer guardianship. Uh, of ourselves. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's a way to help ensure that this goes well. Uh, yeah. Okay. And these vassals want council positions, but I mean they love me, so it's not they can't want the council position that badly. We are happy to accept. Okay, great. So that that daughter is now my ward. That's cool. And uh, let's see. Great. Got some got some faith money. Very good. Yeah, we're we're just in great shape here. Although our air is not. So, yeah, let's see here. Um, like, I wonder if we could just say, like, hey, this this cool kid here. I actually want this to be... I actually want her to be... Well, she's not of our dynasty, so that wouldn't work. Yeah, it's gonna get messy when we die, cause that this guy, Eustache, is not going to be able to effectively lead the Kingdom of Jerusalem. Unfortunately. Ended all conversation. Pope has seen my sudden interest and the amount of correspondence as a sign of nefarious plans that appears if he's under the impression that I'm plotting against him. I'm not plotting against you, Pope. Not at all. I just want to be friends. I'm just, just looking to be friends. Hmm. Oh. Um. Yeah, we're, we're very deep into Catholicism. Uh. <laughs> we're uh. We we've gone on a pilgrimage. Uh. We're a crusader queen. Um, well, the bass is still happy with me. Yeah. It's only forty three now. Oh, 
Oh no, mismanaged population in Jaffa. Seems that in my dealings with Count Sophia, I may have accidentally made certain promises of exemptions from her obligations. Oh no! We're gonna reduce our fuel taxes there. running so smoothly. Um, yeah. Don't worry about this. So these guys love me. And those are more to do at some point, but... Okay. Good troops there. How's that holy order we found it doing? Fine. Um, create some more men at arms here, maybe. So much good stuff. All right. Um, that's everything's in a great shape. Um, we're doing well. Everything's secure. We got no problems with the whole succession thing anymore. Everyone else in our family is dead. Um, we have this cool ward, Ansia. Ansia's doing great. Two. Um, oh no, <laughs> uh, Count Eustache has been uh, captured by the Duke of Achaia uh, in the Siege of Messina. Hmm, Eustache, what are you doing over there? What are you doing over there? Uh, <laughs> well, we can't do anything about that. Well, next time on... From Sicily to Jerusalem, we will see what happens with our heir that has just been imprisoned during the Siege of Messina by the Byzantine Empire. All right, that will do it for this one. We had a lot of progress here. We became queen of Jerusalem. Huge. Huge. Just massive. Just amazing. All right, save it up. Oh, it's auto save, right? It's Iron Man. Um, and uh, yeah, we we're, we're that's that's that. And and uh, here's a cool thing: when we exit this main menu, we'll update, I believe, to show. Yeah, look at that! Look at that! Updates to show myself and my heir, who is not 
not looking great right now. He's, he's seen better days. I'm just a badass. Look at me. Queen of Jerusalem. Nobody's messing with me. So good. All right. Uh, yeah, see you next time.